Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you the sound that no one hates. Now that's how you open up a console. Hey, what's up, man? Hello. I cried. That sound makes me cry of how good it is. Oh, shit. Welcome to guess with number three, which, by the way, I lied. This game is, is not called Resident Evil 3. It's called Resident Evil Nemesis. So I lied. Oh, never mind. It's a three on the title. Never mind. <laughs> I said nothing. I said nothing. Sound is like what? It's just my voice. It's just my voice. Being disgusting. Why the game? The game is like quiet. I don't know, man. I know nothing. You know what they know? Video game. <laughs> ah, what is happening to the micro? I never have anything to say, so it is important. Look at this amazing demo. Insane. What does the mic even have to say? Oh, God bless Mondays. Okay, who's playing? Um, check it. I don't even know. I think someone just speak. Give me a moment. Hello, it is what? It is I. The worst guy. What a cool way to start the week. The humiliation of the rhythm game was so bad. It broke the stream. <laughs> nice dodge. No problem now. Okay, can we play game? Okay, who likes Resident Evil? Everyone. I mean, not really. There are people that hate the controls of this thing. A disclaimer, uh, the rhythm game was so hard mode, yes. Resident the um, rethinking was so bad, the next one is going to be even worse. Just as, just as a spoiler. It all began as an ordinary day in September. An ordinary day in Where are the subtitles? A city controlled by umbrella. Fuck it. <laughs> okay, no subtitles because... Um, gringo version, I guess, whatever. On Dreamcast, yeah. I think Dreamcast... Co this game has a special version in Dreamcast. You have more outfits for you. But there would be no forgiveness. If only they had had the courage to fight. Yeah, you have every outfit unlocked and I think a few extras on the Dreamcast version. Nothing can stop them. No, you only like seven? Do you like the crazy house? I haven't played seven yet. I haven't played seven nor eight. FPS crazy how yeah. I love being chased by grandpa. You know what I love? This sick ass intro. Damn! Look at this shit. Horrifying. I 
Ajax League. Peace, even. This is this in your society. This is really cool intro for the game. It so it shows everything you need to know of the game. There are zombies. Everybody is here to clean the city. Everyone dies. That's it. Morning. Hello. Hello, Mang. It's the same. This intro is not remade in remake. Then again, there are many things I can talk about remake that I want to. I'm here for the fun, okay? Let's not make this a shit fest about what remake is and what remake isn't. You see that? What PS1 game has ragdolls? Is the PS1 even able to do ragdolls? Because I can't think of no game. Yeah, I'm pretty sure, I don't know if the PS1 was able to, to rack dolls. I think there's no PS1 game with rack dolls. This is my last escape. That's the title of the game! In Japanese! Oh shit, can I remove Vibration? No. Oh. Yeah, good shit, dude. Okay, but it's... <laughs> I didn't do a fan sim, sorry. Oh, yeah, dude, I play this game a lot. This is... Uh, I talk about this game a few times because I speedrun this game as a kid because every time you beat the game, you get an epilogue. And I wanted to get all of them, so I got to the point that I just speedrun the game really fast. And I think my best record was like 1 hour 30 or 1 hour 20. Well, that's nothing near the world record, by the way. I think world record is like 40 minutes or so. September I was proud as a kid. The, monsters have overtaken the, city. the first ragdoll game, Dinosaurs and Teeth. You know it. <laughs> you know it. I'm still alive. Yeah, but th those dinosaurs, those in th they don't die. Like Max Payne. No one dies like Max Payne. Okay. We've got to get out of here. Emulator? What? Let's what say I'm playing on a duck, about? okay? Let's just say that. There's Let's just say... Let's just say I'm playing on a duck. I like ducks, okay? I'm sorry about your daughter. Why does the USA version hate the subtitles? No! I'm not going anywhere! Like, there's Resident Evil 1 on the... I think the USA version, there's no subtitles. Resident Evil 3, Nemesis, subtitles, no! Screw you, you don't read. Americans don't read, they listen. We're getting silly numbers. Do you know what's silly? No! I told you! I told you! I'm not leaving! Never! Epic. Just get away from me. The container is locked from Instead. Yeah. Dude, my PS1 is like tu tuned. Because me and my brother were kids. My PS1, which I don't even know if it works anymore. I think it doesn't. Because it, it's still a while. Every single PS1 game I played on PS2. Uh, it's tuned because it has Pokemon stickers. I know there's a Duke Trio. That's, that's all I know. <laughs> yeah, I know how to play the game. Don't worry. Okay, boys. I am... Uh... Giveaway of my old PS1. It has a Duke Trio in it. There's a Duke Trio, dude. And I think there's even a coffin. Same with the Game Boy Color. It has, like, stickers. <laughs> first, first channel giveaway. A broken PS1. With a Duke Trio stick. <laughs> First channel giveaway, my finger. I will cut off my finger to become the ultimate Yakuza. There's manual reload in this game. What's in this? Didn't this game got? R3 is paused. Interesting PS1 topic. 
Were there like manual re reload in this game? Or would Resident Evil included manual reload? <laughs> oh, by the way, it's a PS1, not a PS, uh, the PlayStation, no, it's PS1. Listen, the PS1 that is small, is called PS1, right? Because we have PSX, that's like the classic, the, the fat one. And then they made PS1, which is really tiny. That's the one I got. Which now I think about it, it's kind of funny because I never owned an original PlayStation console. I got PS1 is small. PS2 Slim, the small one, and even the PS3 I got was the Slim. 3 P. Uh, I, <laughs> I never got the like the first version. I'll choose map. L2 is map. Nice. I don't know if you can say the same for every console. Well, I mean, we I got the original Wii. DS, dude, I got the original DS for a. The entire DS cycle, and that thing was fat. You got the DSi, DS Lite, they look beautiful, and I got the original fat DS. Like, ugh. a fat PS2 and 3 at the moment. Oh shit, but fat PS3? I mean, here's the thing they are better, as far as I know. Oh shit. Because the. Did you want to see a funny? Nothing. As far as I know, the when they do the slim version of consoles, they uh, remove a few things, which I th I think, for example, the PS2 slim, I think it doesn't have online play. Which that made me feel like a dumbass, because I talked about this a few times. I wanted to play Resident Evil Outbreak 2 online as a kid. But I was a dumbass, I had no idea what was happening, I was a kid. My brother knew even less. And I even remember my dad actually helped to my dad, and the poor guy knew even less than my brother. And fun fact, I think you can't even play online on a PS2 Slim. The small one. Oh, yeah. And that's the one I wanted to talk. The fat PS3, it's really important. That's the good one. That's, that, that was extremely expensive, but you could play PS2 games on that thing. Oh shit. I mean, mine broke for reasons, but that was one of the reasons why the original PS3 was so expensive. Because it could run the PS2 games, and that's probably the coolest thing of the original PS3. Why are you two of you here? So, I mean, if the one you have cannot play the <laughs> PS2 game, it's the same. Oh shit, I got puked! Okay, no hit run, destroy it. Yeah. I mean, I would love to have one just to play PS2 games, but... As far as I know, they are rare and really expensive. On the Resident Evil. Okay, dude, I'm gonna destroy the Resident Evil in an epic way. By the way, I shouldn't be doing this. I want to kill every single Nemesis encounter. And I think it's a terrible... I, I think I'm... I don't even know if I can kill Nemesis right now. I'm losing ammo. I, I you need a lot of ammo. For, the first Nemesis is the hardest one. Oh yeah, the Fat PS3, the original one, is kind of rare and expensive, as far as I know, and only because they can run PS2 games. That's the coolest thing in my opinion. But they removed that because you know, expensive. I also remember losing my mind because you have PS3 fat, PS3 slim, and PS3 super slim. And for a while I was confused. Like which which PS3 is what? Who knows this? He's fine. No PS3 is really cool. Is PS3 retro or not yet? At which point PS2 is considered retro? <laughs> because I think PS2 is retro already, and that makes me feel like the ultimate grandpa. Which I guess I kind of am, by the internet standards. 2006. Oh shit, dude. 
PS3 is out to be 20 years old. Holy shit. <laughs> I still remember seeing on TV Metal Gear 4 with PS3, like brand new. Like, oh. Yes. Me as a kid going, oh shit. Oh, wow. PS3, Metal Gear 4, no way, that's awesome. I still remember that clearly. And then my friends and people go, yo, Metal Gear 4, it's awesome, the PS4, the PS3, this. Yo! Like, holy shit. I'm not helping, by the way. I'm not wasting more ammo. So I already did. Guess what did he say? Yeah. Gears of War was huge back in the day. Like, completely massive. I don't know if it still is. I think the after the trilogy, it went a little bit downhill, but the original trilogy are classic. Classic, classic games. Reasons to get an Xbox. Also, shout outs to the original Gears of War trailer. The one with uh, Mad War. Brad, hang in there. Why isn't someone doing something about this? I didn't know you were still alive, Jill. The police aren't trained so for this kind of situation. That's the thing. I, I think they're still good, but Listen, Gears 5 wasn't bad. I played Gears 5 on a free weekend. We're both gonna die. <laughs> oh, shit. I remember what playing Gears of War 5. You'll see. With, a, with friends on a free weekend, and all I remember is spamming Batista bombs on the on the enemies. No on this uh, awesome or mode, the horde mode. I love that thing. I always loved that from Gears of War. A spamming Batista bombs, and one of my friends was always Batista. <laughs> I just remember that and having all the fun. I always like the French. I like third person shooters a little a bit. That's why I enjoyed Max Payne. Sorry, I don't know if I should call the single floor clone. Yes, third person shooters, but. I, mean, I don't even know how many third person shooters cover base are out there before Gears of War. There has to be. We can put Manhan on the top. Manhan 2, maybe. There's a, at the end of Manhan 2, the game is a very, as far as I remember, there's a lot of. Oh shit. Shooting. The last mission of Manhan 2 is just shooting everyone. Uncharted came out a year, a year after. I cannot believe Uncharted rip off Marcus Phoenix. <laughs> oh shit. I remember just I remember watching Gears of War things. Never owning an Xbox. Never owning one. Main reason I want an Xbox was Dead Rising. The original Dead Rising, of course. No! I know there was some bonus like Gears of War and things like that. With this game uh, a lot <laughs> a lot <laughs> we need to open this no please she puked uh, I think you need to beat the game eight times to get every epilogue you need to beat the game eight times so as a kid I beat the game eight times in a row <laughs> just straight as I said I, I beat the game like in one hour 30 which that's nothing as a, for a professional guy but for me, it was huge. And a few more times. I love Resident Evil. It's one of my favorite franchises. And it's a classic. So, I, this... this uh, the remake? Yeah. I got the remake as a... What did I, I don't even remember when I played the remake. But I remember playing it... With a friend? And I really don't start, I don't want to start the hate train because you, you talk about remake three, and you should hate. And I understand. All I can say is the game is fun, but as a remake is as a remake is a failure. As a base game is alright. It's clearly a DLC for remake two, which is for me the, the better when it comes to two and three. And. Uh... 
Vianney was C uh, gunpowder. Okay, this one first. Uh it's rough done because the thing is I'm gonna be honest with you. There are people that hate how this game controls. There are people just how the game looks. I don't know how are you when re with retro games like I mean this game doesn't control bad, but it has tank controls. G give me a second, let me read something with the gunpowder. Does B is shotgun, but I think A and B shotgun. Plus C, grenade, 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 magnum. Yeah, A and B, I think it gives me shotgun, which I need that right now. I made a mistake. I made a mistake, but oh well. I just saved, so if everything fails, it's whatever. I think this is now. So the thing is, this game has tank control, which for many people, that's uh, not good. And let me explain you, that's like, you press right, you do this. You press left, you do this. You press up, you do that. You see, it's like, you're like a tank. That's how people, that's why it's called tank control, so. There are many people that hate this control sim. I like it. I grew up with this thing. So, I don't mind. And then you run with a baton, you aim, you shoot, you have auto aim in this game. In this game, you have auto aim. And then you have the menu when you do a lot of things and you know it's stressing evil. You explore the town, you get items, you go places. This one is really cool because you explore the entire town. So you are running through the entirety of Raccoon City. Ra Raccoon City. I should bring the knife just in case. So that's really nice. And then you have placed things on that. that. But now what should you play the, th the original three or the remake? That's rough because the problem is, as I said, remake. That's a huge issue is that half of the game is gone. And I'm not it's not a prank, it's not it's not a joke. When it comes to remake 3, you are missing half the game. Because Resident Evil 3 has like uh four segments or three you will. You have the town, Raccoon City, then you have the um, The Clock Tower, you have the Clock Tower. And then you have the park, which is like an extension of the clock tower, and then you have the lava. Remake 3 does Raccoon City, the town. And then you do a little bit of sewers, and then lava. So you, the entirety of clock tower is gone. And that's the reason why people hate the remake. Because one entire segment of the game is gone. Also, there's also, there's also a point in the game where Nemesis, this gentleman over here, the main stalker, best game stalker, but <laughs> he chases you everywhere, he's everywhere. Uh, there's a point that he just disappears. He, like, he just vanished from the game. With that's a, uh, you know, you're probably going to resemble three Nemesis. That's disappointing. Yeah, he just killed the drive. Oh, shoot. He has killed the pilot from Resident Evil 1. Oh shit! Oh! So all I can say is that... Um, I mean, I, you said you only played Resident Evil 4. Resident Evil 3 plays like Remake, Remake a little bit. Kinda. Shit, cool dodge. But the point is you're missing... The game itself is fun. The thing is, it's short. It's a lot shorter. And you don't have replayability like Remake 2. Like Remake 2, you have Leon A, Claire B. And then you can do Claire A, Leon B. Oh, shit, already? <laughs> well, my bad. There's an expert in this fight. You can lock him in, in his place, and he runs in place. So I honestly say... I honestly still play the original, because it's like the... It's like the true remake, because it has more content. Yeah, it is what it is. This is the hardest fight in the game. Because I want to kill Nemesis in every encounter. In this game, uh, just also in Remake, if you play on hard mode, every time you kill Nemesis, he drops an item. The last item he drops is unlimited ammo for, a, for any weapon you want. So honestly, I'll say play original because it's the extended version, but maybe you will enjoy Remake more. Maybe you like the gameplay loop more. Maybe you like I don't know how the game feels.
I honestly say that Remake 3 is like a it's a okay game, it's just kind of short. Yeah, as a remake it's a failure. That's all I got to say. And it's funny because we got to the point that you cannot talk about Resident Evil 3 without talking about remake. <laughs> Which understand now it's a hot topic. And it's silly because this franchise has four remakes. Four proper remakes. One, two, three, and four. No remake. Though that's my favorite Resident Evil game. Would you know Resident Evil remake plays like this? It's the only remake that plays like this, like old school. Two play with the you know over the shoulder camera and moving and shit. I mean, Resident Evil games can be Oh, it's unskippable. Okay, in no, I played the Wii version and the Steam version. I never got a GameCube. Shit. I only play the Wii and the Steam. Can I dodge? Good dog. I'm gonna play it safe. I mean, the, the Wii version and the Steam version is the same thing. Hey! I mean, the Steam version has an enhanced graphic and stuff like that. Hey! But that's my favorite Resident Evil game. At least when it comes to the mainline games. Can you go down? It's shit. There's the dodge. Look, he's not going down. <laughs> There it is. Now everything's handgun. <laughs> yeah, I, I like Resident Evil. I like the games. Also, I think I'm dead because no healing. I'm barely a not good ammo. <laughs> Cool dodge. I think I'm. I'm doing something. Just yeah, a glitch. <laughs> I never did this before. Oh shit! He's a smart. I think I'm dead. Images, please. They got the smart nemesis. He can break the the exploit. Ow! Oh. Okay, I'm in danger now. To heal the exploit, help! <laughs> he can only kill with the grab, by the way. If he grab, if he grabs me and the there you go. Like, there's a, the actual strategy to make this fight easier is just you chase him out in that corner and you knife him. I never did that before. I know things. You know what I don't know? When is Capcom going to release the classic trilogy collection? When is that coming out? I want that. I will buy that at a high price. Let me replay this, these games on the Switch or the, on the Steam or whatever. Why do I need a bug to play these games? Give me, let me buy it on the Switch. Let me try the cheese strategy. Which I never tried before. And, and I don't even know if I can kill him with 36... 
handgun bullets and seven shotgun shells. But after this, oh by the way, I didn't mention this. Re three remake has a demo, I think. So I guess you can check that out and check out how the game feels. The game, the demo, pretty much is the best part of the game. The town and early on. Brad. He's fine. How do you cheat the messiah? I'll show you real quick. By the way, nothing is forcing me to kill it. Nothing is forcing you to kill it. I just want to do it because I want a magnum with unlimited ammo later on. How do you break Nemesis? I'll show you. <laughs> oh shit! Yeah, I'm not good enough. Pay great table player. He died. <laughs> Pay. I'm sorry. I lied. All those times I beat the game as a kid, I lied. It was my brother. I forgot to take... Oh, kill him. Do I want my unlimited ammo? Oh, she knight. Dragon of Porn War 2. Is he getting stuck? You see? That's how you do it. That's the exploit. <gasps> Why is he smart? Why am I fighting the smartest nemesis? Yet. Welcome to 8 hours of dying to his nemesis. Take it out. It's happening. Other, other. <laughs> He's smart. There you go. We punish. <laughs> we, have to, we do the punishment. <laughs> we dodge. Unchaseable nemesis. Oh! The course of the scenario just fuck. Oh shit. He's, he just jumping, he's just walking over the where I need him to be. I think I'm dead. I'm gonna. I'm gonna be there really soon. Welcome to the worst guy playing the game. Oh shit! I'm not even dodging. Okay, this one is deadly. Yeah, he's dead. Ow. Next one is deadly. I'm dead. <laughs> Holy shit, dude. Hardest fight in the entire game. Nemesis 1. Am I going to do it? I guess not. Man, you can play, you can even get cool things without killing this nemesis. Like, the coolest thing you get is a desert eagle. And you have a cool shotgun. I can just ignore, listen, worst case scenario, I ignore him and that's it. This man doesn't know the strat. I mean, he knows the strat, but he cannot do it. What a loser. You got me. You got me. I don't worry, dude. 
I'll be here all day, folks. I'll be here all day, folks, but not tomorrow. Oh, Chris, I noticed that no one gives a single fuck. Um, I got the GDA 3 reblow ready. So tomorrow I'm not here. It's going to reblow at the usual time. And we have a, a... And I finally made a thumbnail. So that, that's it. No, no steam tomorrow is a reblow because... Yeah, I died. It got deaded. Brad! I hope you don't love Brad, because he's gone. Okay, let me try the cheese back with an actual weapon this time. It lit, bastard! Why is he breaking the, the exploit? How is he breaking it out of being <laughs> Smartest nemesis. I guess I'm doing something wrong. Oh. Yeah, he's learning. Yeah, pretty much. Look at that grab cancel. Oh, oh god. I cannot dodge for my life. A smartest nemesis, man. Am I dead? Please don't. Oh. <laughs> I don't even know if you can brute force it. I have other healing. Hardest fight, Rain Circle. Okay, we just found the, the weak spot. Run, dodge to the right. Let's go. Dude, it's like Taken. You sidestep to one direction, and he's weaker. Because you can dodge. And I will have to knife, because... I'm running low on ammo. Can you go down? Thank you. I, I, I'm not winning. I have like 21 swords. He's stronger than that. Are you, can you see the cancels he's doing? He's canceling the forward smash. I think I can survive. I think I can survive. <laughs> the ultimate bio weapon. You can run in circles around it. <laughs> okay, I'm killing. The ultimate bio weapon. Run in circles. Holy shit. That can lock in. A grab. Cool. Yo. Six swords. Ow. Oh god. Nice aiming. Cool dodge. I think the dream is dead. I think the dream is over. No, please. Evilest resident. We found him. Where's the dodge? No! 
Next grab is deadly. Take that. Uh, I don't even know how I'm supposed to do that. Cool dodge, I'm dead. Ooh, do I need help? <laughs> Welcome to the first check choke point. Ah, it's fine. I mean, I can always... Listen, let's make more shotgun ammo. You have the cool cheese so you can knife it, and then you have the bad cheese that you can insert because around it. Resident Evil. It's not freedom. It's Don't worry, though. You know what's freedom? Dying to Nemesis. You are released from this world. But don't you worry. I think I can do it now. I found the... Dodge to the right. Dodge, dodge to your left. You just like Tekken, dude. You dodge in one direction and it's better. But check it. That was terrible, nice. One good thing out of the day, one bad thing out of the day, I guess. But don't you worry, we're gonna defeat Nemesis. We're gonna defeat Nemesis and save the world. But after this Nemesis, it's supposed to be easier because I'm gonna have. I think. I mean, I think I'm going to have more heal. You can take the launcher or the Magnum. So that's something. Okay, let's try to survive. Jill, 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 they're forcing me to play Cruelty Squad. This is what happens when you hate Cruelty Squad. Nemesis gets you. Ow. Nemesis loves Cruelty Squad. Oh god. Cool dodge. The game looks healthy. Yeah, dude, I found Nemesis weak spot. Refuse to use it. It's not you! We're fine. The man can run! I got this now. Cool dodge. How many shots do you need? This one. Full dodge. I think I'm dead. I think I'm dead for... Because I didn't heal. I think I'm dead. No! Just because I, I refuse to heal. Holy shit. <laughs> Welcome to dying to Nemesis. <laughs> Chance <laughs> of survival negative. And never forget, no one is forcing you to kill him. Resident but I want to do it. Kill Nemesis. President, fuck, I'm sorry, dude. I really apologize. I apologize for sucking ass against Nemesis. Here. 
I'm gonna go ball south now. Check it. L this is it, boys. One out of nine to Nemesis. Who's with me? I don't even remember how I healed this thing as a kid. But the first fight is the worst. And as a kid, I mean... Early teen, I guess. As a kid, I was terrified of these games. Every time I say as a kid in these horror games, like Resident Evil, Selling Hill or whatever, it was my brother playing. I was terrified of these games. And no game scared me as much as Silent Hill 4 and 3. I think I was scared of 4 more than 3. Which maybe that's why 4 is my favorite. Which you know, it's, it's sinful to say. This man likes Silent Hill 4. Kill him. Yes. I like when Walter Sullivan gets silly. Eat this, Paul. Dodge. I am mean, now. Uh, as far as I remember, when it comes to as a kid, as being scared of these PS1 games or PS2 or whatever, I think the game that scares me the most was Silent Hill 4. I, I remember being like. I think it's the only way as a kid I remember just looking away from the screen out of horror, of fear. Or just feeling bad watching the game. Nothing has scared me more as a kid than when your room gets haunted. Do your thing. But you know, in this game, always Nemesis really scary. For some reason, I never found Nemesis that scary. Actually, oh, yeah, he's an asshole. He wants to kill you. He looks intimidating, but more than scary, I always thought he looks cool. Which I guess that's what everybody thinks about Nemesis. Found ya. Oh shit! That is main attack. He either punch you or grab, or grab you and throw you. Main attack, throw. It's painting. Let me see. It's scary. True horror game as a kid with the plus games. Ow. Hey, finally. Now we're in Now everything should be smooth sailing. He loves such shit. He loves eagle. He loves such shit. Let me see. He's awesome. Finally, they were defeated. Never mind. You do too that much. Uh, here's the thing. Nemesis barely. He doesn't get knocked back. He doesn't matter what you shoot. He doesn't get knocked back. Gun, shotgun, grenade launcher, magnum. He has. He sometimes does like a, a little flint, but that's nothing. Yeah. You can make a deagle. Yeah, listen, if you kill Nemesis once, you get the deagle. If you kill Nemesis twice, you get um, three first aid sprays in one. You kill Nemesis three times, and you get uh, the part B, so you can get a desert deagle, which is a better handgun. You kill Nemesis again, and you get shotgun parts. Again, it's another first aid, first aid spray that is three on one. And then you have another shotgun. And after that, I think it's the... Um, the unlimited ammo.
This is gonna be awesome. I th I, I think that thing is going in remake. Prestige map. This is gonna be awesome. Um, even though my favorite Resident Evil game of the original trilogy is still one, I, I love Resident Evil one a lot. Oh, what's the password? Sorry. Oh, by doing this, you can skip a segment, by the way. 0513. This game is awesome. It's the same the remake didn't deliver that much. It's still okay. Reset to save. Oh shit. I want to try and save ammo. And I'm gonna get beaten to death. If I die, I need to fight Nemesis again. Because you know, no checkpoints. Welcome to old school gaming, no checkpoints. <laughs> so I'm just gonna tank these zombies for the sake of ammo. It's fine. Nice. Dude, that sound effect scared me I was a kid because my brother, as I said many times, my, I, I grew up with a brother and a cousin that loved to scare me as a kid. That sound effect that sounds like, sounded like um, a door closing. They told me it was Nemesis coming for me. And that scared me a lot. Even though I said that Nemesis... That's probably, that's probably the thing that scared me the most about Nemesis. Even though I said a moments ago that I never found Nemesis that scary. Because you know what was really scary for me? The unknown. <laughs> In a way that... I saw my brother play this game so much that I knew almost everything. I knew basically everything. So when you play the game again and you are in a situation that you don't, don't know, that's what is scared me. And this game has out of that because... Oh, I think I need the lighter. Because this game has a lot of um, different segments. This game has choices. Oh, she's never she's... Oh yeah, this ain't Resident Evil 2, I guess. Or can you? That's what you need. Nemesis is coming and he wants you ass. I would say with memories, but... I was really scared of many things because of my brother. Oh, this was a shotgun moment because blowing heads off. And all of this is for healing, if I'm not mistaken. Who's, who's alive? There you go. All the handgun ammo for what? For healing. Or two reds that I cannot even take right now. Yikes, okay, I'll be back. Yeah, dude. The thing I hated the most about growing up with my brother is that I had this horror factor of brother of scaring me. They scared me once in a point that at the end of Final Fantasy VIII. Oh shit. So I missed the ending of Final Fantasy VIII. And that's something I remember regretting. Because this scared me. I mean, I know how it ends. I beat the game on my own. 
which is another never forget a baby playing Final Fantasy games are it's tough unless it's Mystic Quest that's another story David's memo. Not the David from Outbreak. David the Cop. No. Well, that's also another Francis. Uh, not Francis, it's still Resident Evil. One of my favorite Resident Evil games is Outbreak. Which I'm still waiting anything Outbreak related, but... I guess Capcom hates it. Shit. Capcom just pretty much hates it, I guess. Outbreak, I mean. That saddens me. So every single game has been remake and new. And remake is really faithful to the original, at least some. But and then new, they just do whatever they want with seven and eight. You know, they are vampires, they are the crazy grandpa. They do whatever they want. I don't mind. There are people that hate that. So this franchise is really weird because there are people that absolutely despise some games in this franchise. Canadian launcher. Okay, let me reach a safe, a safe spot. I don't want to get consumed by zombie. I know this place is safe. Let's get, refuses to go by now. <laughs> he just humble. Too strange. <laughs> I hear like do other things, I guess. He other do other things, and I that's respectable. You do a stream and sucks your soul out. Talking about experience. <laughs> I am a nobody. Okay, let's watch, while we watch this cutscene, let me just open the thing. Okay. Who wants some Nemesis fan art? What is this? Well, oh, that's Bersa. This is your, your friend. Do you want me to show all of this? Wait, do you want me to show all of this or hide the secret of this cool artist? Is that a furry? Do you want to see everything or do you want to hide the secret, but Look at this cool Nemesias. Holy shit. That's a cool drawing. Look at the detail on the things. Look at the detail on the, let's say, the, <laughs> the machinery. Oh, that's cool as fuck. <laughs> now that's... Now that's sick. There's more on the way. This is like a Digimon. But that's the arm of Mr. Birkin. Is that his full soul? No. <laughs> that looks really cool. Look at the detail. Damn. I cannot even draw a stick, man. And you have another sweet the Messiah. Look at him. Look at that sweet the Messiah. But it's just a, a doodle, I guess. He looks really cool. 
Ah, this is just uh, not really any but it's still awesome. Look at that. It's him. It's Berk. It's nuts from Berk. Those are really cool. These drawings are really cool. Thank you for sharing them. <laughs> no, seriously, they are really cool. That's some nice art from the Messiah and friends. Impressive. It takes time. I remember how I told to myself that I wanted to learn how to draw this year. I still haven't done shit. Does your brother take commissions? <laughs> I'll give your brother money for the stupidest thumbnail you can imagine. <laughs> can he draw this? <laughs> ah, it's fine. Really cool artist. I really like. Oh, did you hear that? Oh, shit. Yeah, as I said many times, I. Just... Drawing is a skill I always, um, I always like, but I never got the time. Oh shit. Oh shit. What the fuck? Oh my god! <laughs> Watch it now. Okay, dude, Monster Hunter Jesus Ultimate. I'll give him Monster Hunter Award <laughs> for the <that. laughs> Sikes ni Siki Jammer. No, dude, I want, I want him to draw anime bullshit. The most anime thing that he's going to hate. I want him to... I want... I'm going to force him to draw things he hate. I cannot draw things. I can't draw, dude. It's funny because if I actually took it seriously, the, I want to learn how to draw. To, in 2024. It will be four months of trying. And guess what? I really, I really have nothing. I can't do nothing with my life. I don't have time, and the little free time I have, I do nothing or I sleep. He does Drogedoro. Oh, shit. That's sweet. Isn't there a season 2 coming out? Of Drogedoro? I really enjoy it. Oh, camper! I like how Jill just can tank a rocket launcher. Ow. I don't remember what the steam it was. The stream I talk about throwing and shit. And how I would like to, but I never got the time or the skill or the patience. But not the patience, I have patience. Star, star. If there's something I can talk about me that I have patience. But the thing I don't have is the... The time these days, sadly. Star, star. I, it's some, oh, just a weird one. I guess it's the... Uh, I don't know, I don't get what the word is. Getting there every day, I can do it for a while. But for some reason, it, it stops. It's because I have not played on me. Ow. Free to the gods. Oh, he's mad! Then this. Second drop, uh, healing, right? Oh shit, never mind! Okay, now the game is a lot easier. Because the, the, the Desert Eagle is kind of broken. You do more damage, you shoot faster, and it's easier to headshot. That's really nice. Oh, and also it looks awesome.
But yeah, so those two uh, people who can draw. That's something I really wanted to do, but... You know. It's as easy as... Do anything a little bit... Per day. Draw a little bit in... In the day. That's it. That's what they did. I arrived here and just... As I said a few times, I just... I, all my free time in the day that is not streaming or... You know, the, the work, I guess, the job. It's like one hour or... Or one hour before the stream, and that's it. And for the most part, I just want to just sit back and do nothing. Watch whatever. And sal sadly, that's not how you live your life. You need to push. You need to push when you cannot do it. That's how you move forward. I can also do it on night time, but since many streams end up uh, for me at like, what? 11 p.m. or 12 a.m. It's like pretty much go to sleep. A stream over, take a nap. That's pretty much it. So it's not like I don't have the time. It's like... I guess that's everything in my life. I think I'm lazy. That's the true problem. That's the main evil of everything. Laziness. Because another thing I told from time to time, back in 2020, uh, 2021 I think it was, or 2020, I tried to learn Japanese. And I think I gave up at some point. So if I didn't give up, it would be like four years of learning a language. And guess what? That would be awesome. Four years is a lot of time to learn something. And guess what? I'm useless. <laughs> but oh well. So that's something I can say all the time. Just, I guess, push. Oh shit, what was that? I guess push when you're tired, push when you're something. That's how life is. Nothing is easy. Anime stuff. <laughs> Welcome to the art review. Boys, if you have art, send it. Welcome to my art review. I'm not going to show the doodles I did when he's trying to learn how to draw because it's extremely embarrassing. Which maybe that's... I guess that's also part of the reasons I stop. Is because they are so dog shit. So terrible. It's like... Uh, which guess what? That's the point. No one starts knowing. That's part of the... That's the thing in life. You need to start somewhere. Even, even this brother of yours, how bad as he draws, at some point he's doing must be whatever. But he never gave up. He, he keep, kept on pushing. And guess what? Now he draws a sick nemesis. Let's just see a safe room nearby, so I will show the thing there. Don't worry. That's how it is. That's how everything in life. Everyone starts at some point in one. Yikes. That was... Out of useless. Out of useless pain. Full of shit. Full of shit. <laughs> Full of shit. Damn. This is a headshot. Can you die? Dog. There it is. It's also the thing about drawing. Everybody learns in a different speed or a different rhythm. As far as I know. And everyone has a different style. Oh, 
they're always a really interesting topic. I really, really would like to learn. Look how everything tidy is. Okay, new uh, cool art, I guess. Who's this cool mania? <laughs> Who is this gentleman? Oh, it's Akira. Holy shit. <laughs> Look at this anime. <laughs> At least I have seen before somewhere. Okay, boys, new art is coming up. Because your brother is sick. Look at that. Damn! I think I've seen this before, but I don't know where. For some reason, the first thing I thought was Schoolomania. <laughs> I have Akira. I, I watch Akira. Cool movie. Look at this shit. Look at look at that background. Look at this arm. Damn. My Hero Academy. That's my Hero Academy. Okay, that's where I see something, but I have no idea what it is. Because I've never seen that. I mean, I've seen things, but not entirely so. This looks awesome. And then you have this. Damn, it's Dead Note. Holy shit. Look at that hand. Look at that hand. <laughs> and then you have this gentleman. <laughs> Look at that face. <laughs> These are some sick drawings, dude. Yeah, this really looks like a One Piece character. I can't think of none right now, but he really looks like Oh, that's her style. Who was this gentleman? I'm supposed to like One Piece. One Piece is my thing. But I can't think of none right now. The name, at least. But he really looks like something from One Piece. Dude, your brother is sick. Yeah, but the thing is, it's from One Piece, but I don't... I cannot remember the name right now of the character. One Piece is my thing, but I can't remember the name if that's... It really shows the uh, style of Oda. But your brother is sick, dude. Sick drawing skills. Shit. No! I'm in coaching again. Cool drawing. It's him. Um... Like all this sadness in me. All this sadness because I never drew anything. I would really love to draw my own thumbnails. I mean, not not get the level your brother though. Like, oh shit, new enemy. Whatever. But your brother level is at least to my eyes. Your brother level is kind of high. He really puts attention to the detail. Oh, it's Passos. Well, it's so, I mean, at least all to my eyes, you, your brother puts effort in the little details. Well, that's awesome. As I said, Shiryu. Who was that manga? Oh, he's with... he's with Teach? I forgot about this manga. He's a black beard asshole. Check out that Biohazard 4 on the left. Biohazard 4, known as Devil May Cry. No. 
Shout out to Drawing. That's gonna be the entire stream now. <laughs> That's gonna be the entire stream. Shout out to Drawing. If you draw, you're awesome. Either good or not that good or whatever. You're awesome. If you draw that sick. I mean you, dude. I'm I'm still surprised that when we, when we played Blood and Bacon. You were doing cool drawings by shooting at the wall. How did you even do that? <laughs> I'm just surprised. You were doing a... I mean, with the limitations of shooting at the wall in Blood and Bacon. You did that. You at least did Nisiki's face and you can appreciate that it's Nisiki. I think you also did a flower? What's that? Calm down, lady. I'm no zombie. My name's Carlos, Corporal of Umbrella's Biohazard Countermeasure Force. What's your name? Jill, did you just say you belong to Umbrella's army? Yeah, we came all the way out here to save you civilians. But the mission went bad the minute we landed. Yes. Oh my god. How did he find me? He kind of smells you. Uh, hide inside the kitchen. Check this out. Over here. Check this out. Damn, what an idiot. He's not fight proof. Are you crazy? You could have barbecued both of us. Where's him playing Max Payne? American main character? With a sidekick of your Brazilian friend. <laughs> Where's him on Max Payne? <laughs> Thank you, my good friend. This sandwich. <laughs> that's, that's in the original. That almost makes you a Jill barbecue. But I wanted to say one, one thing before. Yeah, the drawing thing is not. People say that drawing is like a talent you are born with, which I think is also a lie because I've seen people also saying that that you just learn how to draw. You just draw for for a really really long time, or you just draw. Oh shit! I got the item, so I don't care. Help me! Oh shit! Carlos can die, by the way. Carlos can die, and it's a game over. I don't know about this, uh, Julian Witt. I need to ask you something. Why did Umbrella send I need to you ask here? you something. Have you heard the high elves? To rescue the civilians. How kind of you. Considering Umbrella caused all this in the first place, those liars. Look, we're just mercenaries, hired hands. No time for talking. If you can believe me, then join us. Think about it. I'm out. I don't even know this. Uh, oh, shit. Now I have a problem here. With how many things in life you are supposed to be born with talent to be good? I don't know. I like to think that everyone has the same chance. If they put the end of effort. This is like everything in life. Nice and tight. Oh, this is... What was the range right now? I don't remember. But you know, that's how... Oh, wait, I want to save the game. Give me a second. The Messi is not punchy. Please. Oh, he's gone. I think. Mm. 
Nemesis, no Panchi. I still think it's surreal that Nemesis is a playable character in Marvel vs. Captain 3. And also in... I think he's also in Infinite. It feels surreal, but at the, at the same time, it feels awesome. Playable Nemesis in a fighting game. <laughs> I remember back in the Code Veronica days. Back when the internet was just starting. Starting. That was just. This cheat goes that. Oh, you beat the game in this difficulty, or you beat the game with this. Oh, shit! And you found Nemesis choking you. There you go. And then this happened, and this and that. In Code Veronica, I remember reading in this. In these lies, on these many lies, you beat this uh, the game doing this, or the special game mode by doing that, and you unlock Nemesis, a playable character. And I remember my brother and my cousin trying to to do that for a long, long time, and then when they finally completed the challenge, whatever you wanna call it, nothing happened. It was a lie. But the idea of playing as Nemesis sounds insane. Sounds awesome. I hear you. The good old times of the internet. Good old times on the internet, full of lies. Nothing was real. What are you supposed to believe? There it is. So I think now I can get into the... Oh shit! To see that cool reload? Oh, you did all those lies years ago. Thank you for the... For unveiling the truth. Oh, shit, how did you find me? Hola. Hola! Oh, shit. It was a different time. I mean, it's it's hard to believe. It's, it's been so long since I played this game for the first time. Or I, I watched my brother play the game for the for the first time. And I just go on. I, I don't want to devolve this into a monkey wall stream, but it's just a it's a feeling that you think about it. It's been so long since I I watched the game for the first time. And now as an uh, as a quote unquote grown man, quote unquote. <laughs> oh yeah, you can you only need to jump. Oh, there are many things. I can be like that with every game. The only game that will really break me down possibly is Final Fantasy VIII for the memories. And as I said many times, it's not even my favorite Final Fantasy. But it's just the memories. The music and everything. Baby's first RPG. And by baby, I mean me and my brother playing it, which. We can go with a nostalgia trip over the PS1. You know what game is on PS1? Nightmare Creatures 2. Ooh, now that's a good one. Now that's a good one. Which I was upset as a kid with that game. I remember thinking I was the main character and in the middle of nowhere just pretending like I was him. I was Wallace. Cool noises.
Yeah, Sigas memories when you're a baby. Playing all PS1 games. I went from Super Mario World, which I, I refused to run because I was scared of running because I fell down or anything, into whatever this was. Which I don't even remember the, the first game I played on PS1 as a kid. Oh, it's bad. I'll take it. Oh, that's bad. Oh, that's terrible. <laughs> Holy shit, I didn't remember that was that deadly. Well, I mean, an exploding button just blew out my face. I guess that's, that's one of the most deadly, deadly things that can happen to me. Well, God, God bless I saved. God bless I saved. Boys, guess what? Don't tank with your face an explosive barrel. It's not worth it. Now I'm going to tank Nemesis with my face. Oh, there he is! Oh, shit! He wants to choke slam. Yeah, what the? I think you know weird horror games I played as a kid, but besides Silent Hill and Resident Evil, I never played something else. I don't know if Soul River counts as scary as a kid, but I can assure you. There were some instances in Legacy of Kane Soul River. I was extremely scared. Dude, that's... I think that's the only game in my life I ever shut down the PS1 out of fear. Which is funny because I don't know if the game counts as horror. It's like a, it's like a Zelda game, but a, a gothic. Ho I mean, it's gothic horror, but it's not like. Ooh. It's like a Zelda game. You just run around and you go to dungeons and get power ups and go to the next dungeon. It's like Zelda. <laughs> Which that's another game I need to play at some point. There was nothing else over here, right? No. Just that notes that I don't care. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Kill me! Ah! Go see. <laughs> Thank you. The word goth is in there. True horror has, achieved, has been achieved. I need to play that game at some point. Maybe even the entire trilogy. I never played 3. Dude, I played a lot of 1 and 2, and, and I only beat those games once in my life. I think, I mean, not once in my life. I think I beat them 2, maybe. Both of them. But as a kid, I played a lot of Soul River games. 1 and 2. That was a really tough time. I remember one time I was stuck, I had no idea what to do. And my brother found a guide to help me. But I didn't understand the guide because I don't know where I was specifically. And I tried to follow the guide and I didn't understand what the guide was saying. And my brother got really mad. My brother got really mad because he found a guide and I didn't understand the guide. <laughs> And when I say really mad, I mean really mad. It was other times. That game was tough. I mean, I think it was only one section that really got me because 
You need to push some pipes. And I just had no idea. Gently get on the pipe. Push it. I didn't know. Well, there are many things I need to do. Do they still need to do Kenshi? There are many things I need to do. <laughs> and on May 16th, Ghost of Tsushima is coming out. And I'm supposed to be playing that because I want to play that. So I'm somewhat on a clock. Like in one month. Okay, now please don't kill. Oh god. We need to play some shit, boys. What's this? Kenzie, it's a game that I don't, I don't... How do you even explain Kenzie to a guy? I need this zombie out of the way. How do you even explain Kenzie to someone? You just exist, do things, and things happen. There you go. But you know what? Screw you. A squad based sandbox RPG. Yeah, I guess that's one way to go to say that. A squad base. Finally, they smack me with a squad. Yeah, I'm really nothing because I, I kind of know everything. I'm sorry. I'm sorry for being a fake gamer. You're one of the survivors from the rescue team, right? I just ran into your teammate, Carlos. How did a girl like you manage to survive? Hey, I'm no ordinary civvy. I'm a member of STARS. STARS? You mean the RPD Special Force Team? Ugh. Hey! Is someone wounded back there? He's fine. Hello, are you wounded? Fire! Fire! Oh, this looks bad. <laughs> uh, they're coming! Get ready! Uh, uh, fire! Fire! Stay together! Calm down. You're safe now. Everything is gonna be okay. Hint, nothing will be okay. Shoutouts to Mikhail, the true guy. The true guy. So Jill, did you decide to help us out? It looks like we're the only ones who survived. We should work together. Yes. No, we can't trust her. Why? But Sergeant, we need her help. Our unit's down to you, me, and Lieutenant Mikhail. That's it. And Mikhail's hurt bad. If we don't cooperate, we won't be walking away from this mission. Very well. Fine. Oh, sorry, fine. Then let's go over our plan. We're moving to the clock tower area, which is the designated landing zone for the extraction chopper. Once we get there and give the signal, the chopper will fly in and pull us out. That's yes. a lot of ground to cover. I, I don't think we can make it on foot. The main problem we have is that the landing zone is cut off from here by the fire. So we have no choice but to use this cable car to navigate through it. Fortunately, we can also use it as a moving shield to get us through the worst areas. That works for me. Good plan, sir. Okay, people. Let's get moving. Okay, people. Jill, put this on. Incredible. There you go. Now you have more space in your pockets. That's the wrench. Nice. And now we explore city and get cool items. This game is awesome, dude. I really wonder why Capcom will never do another 
Raccoon City game like this. Open world. I mean, not open world, but something like this. That's when Outbreak can come in. Hey, 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 hey. Where is Outbreak? That's the entire point. Where is Outbreak? I need Outbreak. What is it? I have only one humble request. Oh shit! Nice. I should be shooting an enemy zombie. I have ammo, I can shoot that enemy undead. I think I'm, no, I'm gonna shoot that enemy undead now. What are the brand new hot zombie games? Oh shit. Look at those headshots. Like zombie games that you say yes, classic now. Must play some brand new zombie game. I think to be something. I mean, what? They are billions count? That game is kind of all right now. Oh, that game is kind of all at this point. Do I have no idea what zombie games are out right now? I, mean, I guess let's say all four if you count that one. Now, let's say all four count more as. Infected, I guess. Never forget there was a difference between infected and zombie, at least back in the day. And people really wanted to tell you the difference between them. No, this is a zombie and this is an infected. Know the difference. One is fat, one is fast, the other one is slow and silly. This one is slow and silly. It's silly because it makes silly noises. What are the best zombie noises in the entire history of zombie noises? Call of Duty? And those are some good zombie noises. Oh my god. That was scary. <laughs> Old school jump scares. I should do at some point a marathon of plus horror games, but that sounds a terrible idea. By terrible I mean, idea, I mean plus horror games for the most part are just something screaming at your face. <laughs> That's it. By marathon horror game, I mean, let's play the house, and, and that's it. Now, that's something that really scared me as a kid, that plus game. Which I think, you see that game right now, at this point in time, it's like... Uh, I guess it can be an airy, but it's also kind of cheesy. But back in the day, that was THE horror game. But that's just how we roll. The true horror game on this channel is a rating game. Because after watching me playing that, you are not going to sleep. Jill. You are not sleeping. Hey, the zombies are getting restless. I know. I can hear them. What's going on? I need at least one space for the for the key item. Or I guess I can combine two and hold of handgun ammo. 
Okay, let's combine just for the sake of you get everything. And with the deagle, you have every weapon you need. You have everything you need. Crystals, yeah. Isn't that a good a good line? Isn't that a cool line or it isn't? Chill. Chill. Oh, it's a made first day. wrong? They must have sniffed us out. They know we're here. Hey, calm down. Any objections to my playing hero this time? What are you doing? Carlos! Carlos. Why would he do such a thing? Okay, I guess I'll combine every... All of this, okay? We... Unlimited handgun ammo. Now, you, you're going to listen to the best noise. Shit. Coolest noise. Coolest noise in the franchise. Um, 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 um. Joint, 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 joint. I've been thinking about the Max Payne line out rating games. They call me rhythm rhythmically impaired. Who's the only pair thing is the handguns in my hands and the mix of whiskey and painkillers in my body. <laughs> Dude, I waste having monologues like Max Payne no. was a superpower. That's something I wish I could do. Relax. You need to you need to know a lot of vocabulary. You need to learn to to know a lot of vocabulary and be fast in thinking. I'm fine. Uh, that you cannot have a really cool line and dropping it like 30 minutes later. Oh shit! Max pain! Oh my god! Max pain! Ouch! My ears are ringing. Mine too. Both should be deaf by now. Okay, I'm gonna scrounge up some equipment. There might not be any at our destination. <laughs> you need to be addicted to painkillers to have that level of speech. Here it comes. The maximum painter. Max Payne should be dead. If he really makes painkillers with whiskey, he should be dead a long time ago. <laughs> then again, he's getting like 90 shots per mission. Per day. So I guess he should be super dead by now. But then again, if you are named Max Payne, you're not going you are not dying easily. When I see some, when I see something cool. The gun monster. Guns ended. Permanent guns on the spine. That's how he rolls, dude. I want to play more, more Max Payne, that was super fun. <laughs> Random dying to Max Payne, hardcore mode. Even if he just took a small chance of triggering a silly ragdoll. Or a silly moment. 
But then again, everything's kind of time. Because tomorrow I'm not here and... Oh wait, no. Oh yeah, 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 the book, the book. Wait, no, I'm at Domas. I need to go to the restaurant. Because tomorrow I'm not here and then I guess Wednesday and Thursday is Silent Hill 3. That's gonna be two days, more likely. I guess I'll do some silly on Friday and... and I mean, I guess I don't even know if I'll be here on Friday or Saturday. Listen, more of the story. I do shit. You know, you know how it goes. Only in this channel we do shit. We go from bad microphone into cool art showcase <clears throat> into life choices into we do shit only here we can left the wrench on the safe place the safe room There's another safe room where I need to use it. And then at some point, can see jump scare. Truly a moment. And before you know it, secret Pikmin stream. And even before you know it, even less. Monster Hunter again. <laughs> oh my god, evil bread. Evil crow. There are people that are mad that. There are no crows in the remakes. Who cares about the crows? Do you really need the crow? To be an enemy? There are also people... That they hate the fact that there are no spiders in the remake. I, mean, I know what they were, they were aiming at. A zombie mostly. Zombie game with zombie human and zombie dog. And then a few silly monsters here and there. They wanted the ultimate zombie experience. Wasn't there a zombie game that if you get beaten, you die? Oh yeah, pretty zomboid. You slowly die if you get beaten. And I think also in The Last of Us. That's what broke in the way. I, mean, I never played The Last of Us. But I think if you get you get hit, you die by yeah, this weird zombie mushroom people. Oh shit! Yo, she sent me through the wall. Oh, shit.
Wait, isn't this enemies? Oh shit, wait. There is a nemesis fight right now. I think it'll be fine. I think if I die, I lose a lot of, I lose a lot, of, a lot of time. Like a lot. A lot, lot. I mean, I think because this game works different. This game do its own thing. It's like it's your own adventure. Auto mode, no thank you. Yeah, I think you fight Nemesis now, right? Or maybe not because I found him all the time. You know the answer because if you look up the door, but... This kind of brute forcing it. That's one. What is the other one? Fifteen... Twenty-five? Ew. Epic puzzle by Capcom. With a really cool item to escape this city. And now we're gonna do something really cool. And it's blowing zombies head. Shit. Increase electricity output. Output. Yeah. I like how their heads explode. I think you lose items. I think I lost items if I don't pick the, the exit. Remember, dude, if the voltage is really high, your head blows up. Those are the rules. That's how it works. Oh, it's no nemesis. Maybe because I fought him before. Who needs nemesis? He's not a bitch. No, nemesis is a cool fella. Nemesis is a good dude. He's just doing his job, okay? Leave him alone. Evil zombie will not eat my brain. And there we go. Now I pick the wrench. Where's wrench? Yes. Let's save the game. Why not? You never know when you will face tank a explosive barrel and then die. Yes. 
parking lot. Sí, thank you. Well, I think Nemesis is coming. That is gonna be the entire game now. I think Nemesis is coming. I think Nemesis is coming. I think Nemesis is coming. Power cable. Did you know? Nemesis is coming. Nah. Why will Nemesis come? He will never do such a thing. He's way too busy. Why are they putting Nemesis on Fortnite? <laughs> How about that? Fortnite! Let me see Fortnite. Oh. Are you? I think I'm almost done with the the town, right? Yeah, go back. Use the hose. Get the other item and I think I'm almost done with the first half. The well, first half. Um... Yeah, I guess. I mean, I'll see the first half when you find Nemesis in the clock tower. Then you have the second half. Dog. Welcome to the dog everywhere system. You only face dog, which is indeed an enemy of the Resident Evil franchise. I, I love that video, of the, the making of, of the opening of Resident Evil 1. Because there are videos, I, don't, I mean, I don't know if it was, oh no, no, it was, it's the movie, Resident Evil movie. Because they saw how they used the makeup on the dog to make him look like a zombie. <laughs> because the dog looks confused, but at the same time he looks like fine. I see all movies are indeed movies. I only watched two. The first one, which I will say it's okay, it's fine. And I don't even know which one is the other one. All I remember is... I don't know, dude. it sounds like a fever thing. I remember like some underground place that it was like a town. Wait. And then you have like Russian zombies driving a bike, shooting gun. So I think... Doing like assault rifles. What did you do? It was weird. I had no choice. He was about to turn into a zombie. A zombie. It would have been a threat, so I eliminated it. But he was still conscious, wasn't he? He was as good as dead. And it took fewer bullets to kill him now than it would have if he had transformed. Well, Nikolai, you piece of shit. Not now, I'm busy. Nikolai, you son of a bitch. That makes you realize that your Nikolai is a good guy. He helped the guy, nothing else. Wasn't there another secret item up here? Yeah, I know the password is on the TV. What's the password? Aqua Cure. Cool neck.
Aqua Cure. Pascal is the ad. Aqua Cure. Now that's a puzzle. The only puzzle I remember somewhat choking up was the. Um, in the lab, a water puzzle that you need to do some. Uh, it's not that bad, it's just I remember being confused as a kid. There's nothing here. And right now, I think I can escape the town. The zombies are restless. Yeah. Oh my god. The creatures are here. Kill the other one. Who lame me? Oh, there's another one back there. So the zombies are coming in, in front of Jill and she just aims something behind her. She fears nothing. I think there's one more nemesis and then it's just freedom. I'm freedom, I'm clocked over. That's gonna go faster. There you go. Anus, no, I didn't say that. You are mistaken. I will never say something like that. It's fine. Me saying does means I can see some silly things. And there's nothing silly here. Oh my god! Move! I don't even know why I'm doing this. I don't have that much room on my pockets. No. All I say is Max Payne. All I say is Max Payne and nothing else. Yes. Max Payne. One arepa. I want to eat arepas. Fun bug. I never had arepas in my life. Um, okay. Fake human being never ate an arepa. Come soon, die arepa. Oh my god. Oh shit. How much healing points is an arepa? Oh god, I was loading.
Where, where the headshot? Oh shit! Don't worry, we are fine. The some place for ten minutes. The media arepa some place for ten minutes. <laughs> Dude, that GTA 3 radio was indeed a, a radio. They are panning. Oh my god, Dario! He got gutted. He opened the door and then he died. But the GDT radio was indeed something. 100 songs. Oh shit, we're alive? I wasn't expecting that many songs to be in there. One hundred songs, and all we listen to was the Tohu heavy metal covers, and a few others. Wasn't that amazing? <laughs> I was fun. There are some songs that only played like one or twice, and they were there since day one. So I have no idea what happened. Three hundred pass. Get that iPad. I cannot wait for GTA 5 Red. Listen, if I ever play 5 or San Andres with custom radio, maybe, maybe we'll get wild. I'm thinking of putting every single radio together, <laughs> every single song we got, plus new ones. All that GTA 3 radio was missing was Jong Jia. Jong Jia is all that was missing. By City. Yeah, that's the thing. That's, the, that's, that's what I was talking about. Put every single song. And we, we will be close to 50, 200 more likely. Isn't the limit 200 songs? So there you go, 200 songs on the radio. So we can, so we will listen to Toho Heavy Metal and a few others. And Jong Jia. 200 songs. All of them are Jong Jia. Now here's a real question. If for some reason more GTA happens that is not Chinatown Wars. What would be the smart move? Five or San Andres? Because San Andres is San Andres, but Five has the ragdolls and the silliness. And I never played Five. Oh. It would be like the 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 timeless classic versus a ragdoll mayhem. Ragdoll mayhem. And the bonus of I never played five. San Andres is ass. <laughs> Pretty soon you're in the minority. It comes to that. It's fine. 
You hate San Andres because it's not about mafia, it's about the hood. Listen up. San Andres, it has super jump cheat code. You jump so high, you take damage when you fall down. Is that the, any, the, any other GTA game? No. You know which one is the best. Oh! Look what Nemesis, look at what Nemesis, Nemesis is doing. Thing in opera. I hated it. You hated it because you didn't like it or there was a nasty mission? How slow and boring it is. Isn't pretty much the every single early mission of San Andres is a, a tutorial? Wait. Of emptiness. The first zombie. Ah, it's fine. This, this, this game can be rough. It's fine. Yeah, Resident Evil 3 can be... I mean, Resident Evil games can be tough if you are, if you are not used to them. Ask Rob of this man talking shit about San Andres, dude. You're gonna get executed. I mean, listen, me no, but I'm gonna be honest to you. I don't even remember the last time I played San Andres. So I can't really have an opinion. And I'm being honest, I really cannot give you an opinion because it's been so long since I played San Andres that the only thing in my head are good memories of just being a really, really young child and messing around. Yeah, with the car or playing... You know what my main memory with San Andres is playing the local multiplayer with my brother. Because that's something that San Andres got. Local multiplayer. And I remember the good missions, but I also remember just... What was the place called after Los Santos? I remember every time I played the game, I never liked that one. Where's Nemesis? Village area? Yeah. I don't know if it has a proper name. Yeah, yeah, that, I don't know if I have a proper name or just village area. Where's Nemesis? For some reason, every single time I remember I played the game, because I played a lot, I remember hating that area. Most fun I got in that place is the... Where's Nemesis? All I got there was there was a really cool mountain. Oh, the tallest point in all San Andres. That's the only coolest thing I remember. Everything else is it's just forest or just a road, and there was barely any villages or anything. Just I remember not even enjoying the missions in that place. But then again, it was really, really, really long time. I think it was one that was really cool. It's about... You get one of those wheat machines that just... You drive and you drive, drive, drive people over. Oh my god! Hey! That could have hurt. But then again, I remember also having a lot of fun in San Fierro. Oh shit! Cool dodge. Like having fun in San Fierro and Las, Ven Las, Ven Las Venturas, you got that. Because there are really cool missions in there. I mean, you still casinos in there. But then you have the desert area, and I all I remember about the desert area was learning how to drive a plane. Ow! 
There you go. Freeze rounds, deadly as shit. <sighs> All I remember about the desert area was learning how to drive a plane and their Area 51 ride. That, that's how you get the jetpack. Everything else I don't even remember. And then probably the coolest thing in the game. Possibly one of the coolest things in the game is in the... Um... Ow. It's when you, back, you go, go back to Los Santos and you have the gang wars. To the entire Los Santos. Hey, do you want to know something that really scared me? I talk about this because uh, there are things in this game that scare me. It was because of the unknown. Because I was, had no idea what was happening. But because this game has options. And my brother pick an option, and sometimes I pick another one. And that changed the game a little bit. This one scared me. And I asked my brother to play the game for me. I'm gonna show you what it is. Jump off. You know what this is? This thing. Okay, whatever. Oh shit. That's the worm. Oh god. Yeah, that scared me as a kid. Horror was different back in those days. <laughs> <My dog. laughs> me after Mac Chicken. So that was too much chicken. Oh, see, now we're talking about the scary things. You know what's something that scared me as a kid? Being lost in the village area. <laughs> in San Andres. Like, for some reason, when it was night, and I lost my vehicle, and I'm just driving through uh, nowhere, a little bit of a spoopiness. A little bit, because I got a, shot a shotgun, so it was no problem. Uh, let me have a beautiful... Uh, here, 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 and here. So... Oh, sorry. So we are done with this part, right? But yeah, good old San Andres. Everybody, I, mean, I guess everybody used to love it because now it's all about the GTA 5, am I right, fellas? It's all about the fifth entry. The best GTA's RDR2. <laughs> Who wants that RDR2 rerun? No, I'm healed, I'm healed. No more Estocolm, Estocolm Syndrome. I'm healed. Serious. I'm honest. I don't even want to feast. If I feast, it's in another game. I'd rather open up Final Fantasy XIV and peace in there. I'd rather open up Animal Crossing and peace in there. Cry of fear. Can you beat Cry of, Cry of Fear in one stream? <laughs> yes. Yes if you're blind, not yes if you know what you're doing. <laughs> There's a difference. I remember that game can be... Can be confusing. Cry of Fear is one of those games. Do you know what I need to play? Book of Memories. Yo! 
Okay, what would be the other 0 0.5 stream then, if I do it? <laughs> Living early or what? Max pin hardcore? Taken? Sekiro? Drawing. Okay, boys, time to draw. Stop. Oh my god! Drawing live. Drawing yourself. No, you draw for me. You draw for me. Okay, boys, how about this? If you draw a thumbnail, I assume the game you draw a thumbnail for. New rule. You do a thumbnail, you do a thumbnail, I will play it, the game, whatever it is. There you go. Now you have the coolest shotgun in the franchise. I'm gonna also raise the level. If you prove to me that you beat DMC2, I will also play whatever you want. How about that? <laughs> Here it comes. A spam of Higomori sister thumbnails. I can see thumbnails. No, but I'm gonna play that anyway. It's not. For that specifically, there's no need. You do whatever you want. I should always, I should always say you do whatever you want. Oh. I'm going to commission your brother the Monster Hunter Ultimate, Genesis Ultimate stream. That weekly thing I will do if I if at least try. I'm gonna spend like two hundred dollars for one thumbnail that no one will see. How about that? I will get him McDonald's. Good we'll fight. I guess he will come. I mean, we have a few days before. Uh, before Ghost of Tsushima week. Even though I know Kenzie is more than one stream, it's just something you need to play for a while. Because I also would like to do the Devil May Cry 4, to keep on with the monthly Devil May Cry 4. Mo well, monthly Devil May Cry. And then I guess the rhythm game. With Dreamcast Classic, Base Channel 5. Which I'm not winning. Hey, oh, we're done with the city. It looks like we're ready to go. Here, take this. If you think I did poorly in Rhythm Paradise, you're gonna sit your pants with the Space okay. Channel 5. Uh... Nikolai, like you, you're gonna just be joining us. Probably you will die. I understand. I'll operate the cable car. Let's go. We're done, boys. Jay, we did it. Do your judgment. Yeah. No, don't come any closer. I mean, with Rhythm Paradise, I can assure you, I lost my judgment and my sanity. I lost everything. It's looking good. Looking good. We did it. We escaped Raccoon City. We beat the game. Nothing bad will happen, right? Oh, oh shit. Mikhail! <gasps> uh, Mikhail, he, Hey, what's going on in the back? Yeah, don't worry, Carlos. I will take it out, not you. 
Ok, paso Oh my god Real Goodbye, goodbye Get out of the cable car now Mihail, wait, don't Get out of here, hurry These are really cool cuts here Just by this cutscene alone, Mikael is the coolest. Mikhail. Even though as a kid I like Carlos a lot. I don't even know why. No, the brakes are out. I guess because he's a, a funny guy. You know what's funny? Jump out the of the window from a moving train. Goodbye. It's useless. So how deadly is jumping off the window from a moving train? I know here's the thing, okay, I will say it already, so no one, if some poor soul find this. This is not in the remake. Everything you're about to see is not in the remake. Everything. Oh my god. How there can be zombies in here? Wasn't this a safe space? Nothing is safe. You go. Now you have cool shotgun. Yes. You have more first aids. Hey. Now this shotgun, the Western Custom. Now that shotgun is epic. It's a really good weapon, Joke Society. This game has really nice weapons. Um, let's keep going. Which I feel I'm... Which I'm feeling I'm going low on ammo, but I have a lot of um, gunpowder. The shotgun is fun. Well, the shotgun is awesome. To survive. Maybe we can start helping each other again. Yeah, it's been rough. But we can rest now. No, we're the only ones left. There's no rest for the wicked. Here's a gift for you. Thank you, Carlos. You are truly a cool guy. I mean, I low on ammo. If I kill Nemesis two more times, I think I unlock the um, unlimited ammo. So I can have a magnum. Oh yeah, that puzzle. Magnum with unlimited ammo. Can you believe that? I don't even remember if you can give the grenade launcher unlimited ammo. I cried. 
Now here's a weapon I never use in my life. Mind thrower. I think I barely used that in, in, in my life. Because to play in this game. Yeah, I know the map, don't worry. You can hurt yourself with that thing. Because it blows up. And explosions. Oh my god. Oh my god. Did you know explosions hurt yourself? I can give unlimited ammo to the cool shotgun. You can give unlimited ammo to anything. I don't know if it's a glitch or not, but I remember in Dino Crisis 2. I, I don't know what happened, but I remember my brother glitching the game and giving the knife unlimited ammo. I don't know if it was I don't know if it was a normal thing or not, but it was I don't know. I remember it was funny see the knife and the you know infinite uh, next to the knife. Infinite knife ammo. Nice. You don't see that anywhere. I mean, you cannot see that anywhere because Dino Crisis is kind of dead, so... These are the people that made Dino Crisis. Which as a side note that, as a side note that no one gives a shit. Dino Crisis, Dino Crisis was the fourth game when I take this quote-unquote seriously. Didn't beat it, though. <laughs> it was Dino Crisis 1. I only played she was a kid a lot. Nice. Clock tower key. Look at all this gunpowder. I a remake. I don't even know. Capcom sent many things. I mean, it would be nice. Oh, shit. It would be nice. Dino Crisis is pretty much this, but with dinosaurs. So that's cool. I approve. One of the many forgotten franchises by Capcom. Let me do something real quick. I'm gonna do this in the slowest way possible. As slow as way possible. I wouldn't say no to Dino Crisis Remake, of course. It would be... Insane. Because even though I barely played Dino Crisis uh, 1... As I said, it's here but never beat it. I give up at some point. I give, up, I give up at the end, because that game is puzzle heavy. But that's not what I expected. And at some point, I just, one day, I just wanted to play Yakuza 3. So I gave up like a fake gamer. I would like to go back. Or at least play Dino Crisis 2. That game was awesome. Oh, shit. 
Don't care. Okay, I care. Many cool games that should get a comeback. Like, I've been reading now a lot. Nintendo has mentioned the Mario and Luigi franchise. Yeah, the RPG games. And that made me happy. Because I love the Mario and Luigi remakes. Oh my god, it's him. They are, they are like... Kind of my favorite RPGs of, of them all. I love the Mario and Luigi remakes, RPGs. So it would be nice for them to come back. No, will Nintendo do it? See, I don't know. I don't know. Nintendo never really made those games. It was Alpha Dream. And Alpha Dream kind of died. I mean, kind of died. They went bankrupt. Which they went bankrupt in a really sad way because their last two games were remakes of the first game and the third game. So it feels like it was a last attempt to somehow get money by doing remakes and survive the bankrupt bankruptcy. It didn't work. <laughs> it didn't work. That actually did damage to me. It hurt me a little bit. Growing with those games and I still I love them. And I would love to do a stream of at least one of them at some point. But this disgusting chest. Nothing is there's nothing. There's no order. Epic. No! No! I made a mistake! We are set out to a Nintendo making games. <laughs> That's the only thing they can do. No. No. Yes. No. Yes. 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 Ten years in the joint, 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 made you made you a fucking pussy there you go you know i'm gonna be honest to you i want to play a new gta game only to have a, a radio of insanity wait isn't the message coming now Like, I'm gonna be honest, one of the reasons I enjoyed GTA 3 a lot was the soundtrack. The, well, the soundtrack, the radio, the radio you made, you guys made. <gasps> oh my god! Bring that shit, Kazuma! Use the court. It's shit, don't care. I mean, as I said many times, part of the funny GTA is just driving with the radio. Defeated. Uh, next one is the unlimited ammo. I don't know if that's some everybody agrees or not, but big, big part of the enjoyment I get from GTA is just driving with the music. I love just playing San Andres and having Radio X in the background. 
And you get a lot of bangers in there, like I had so many bangers. Personal Jesus. <laughs> Hold the line. Dun, 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 dun. Love isn't always on time. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> so many good songs in San Andreas. In every game. Why am I getting so many grenade rounds? You know, you see, you see, you see the spider? You see the spider? It's shit. Oh, it's alive. Don't care. You see that one? It's shit. Come on, you got that mid. Even though you say San Andres is ass, the soundtrack is amazing. I guess it also depends on taste. Everybody says that the best soundtrack is either San Andres or Vice City when it comes to radio music. No. <laughs> I really don't care about that weapon. This puzzle always rot rots my brain. The crystal ball, yes, crystal ball. Now check it. I think in the nose is the answer to beat this puzzle. Obviously, the way I beat this is just randomly. That's not how you do it. But... Who made this clock tower a maniac? Nothing will beat putting a flamethrower in a man's just to open a door. But they sure the answer is somewhere. And I always forget. Maybe in the know they just pick up. We don't read, dude. We just brute force things. We just brute force the thing and we survive. Uy. The thing is, I'm not getting the mind, the, my head where it's supposed to be, so I'm just putting things randomly. I don't know the order. Yeah, it's gonna do nothing. Never mind, I did it. Wow, that was. Epic. Okay, who wants to escape the clock tower? I'm having a good rhythm. Then again, I know where to go and what things are happening. Yeah. I'm gonna teach in a, I'm gonna teach a lesson to this evil resident right here. Was 
Where's it? Can I forgo? Uh, I mean, tomorrow I'm not here. Tomorrow I'm not here, but I reupload GDA 3 Part 1. I think there's even a pre-stream already. So, I mean, that's the thing, but I mean... I guess it's, it would be better if I reupload by city, because that, that thing is older. I, mean, I think the pre-stream is up the message, you know. Uh, so it will be Wednesday, and unless something happens, I should be here on Wednesday. Oh, it's processing. Six hours left, never mind. So I guess tomorrow's are here. Uh, oh, not starting. Well, tomorrow, GDF3 part of whatever it's up, I guess. Part one. I can't wait for it to get copyright again. So Wednesday, if I don't get hit by lightning or a ball lightning, uh, it will be Silent Hill 3, because why not? Yeah. I'll let you have a better idea. Unless you have a better idea, which is fine. If... Yeah, Silent Hill 3 is nice. We play the spoopy. The spoopy third entry. I'm getting a lot of Silent Hill 3 seed posts for some reason now. In totally. You play as a sassy Dean killing monsters. That's, that's Silent Hill 3. Or it's like, she fights demons and monsters and she's like, No, I wanna go home to see my dad. Wow, dad, what a weird night. I killed demons with a pipe. Silent Hill 3 is probably the more unnerving one. Okay, real question to the true gamers. But everyone's gonna be blinded because of reasons. Which one is more scary? Silent Hill 3 or Silent Hill 4? See? Through all the hatred you want, Silent Hill 4 can be really unnerving sometimes. If you are blind. 2, 3, and 4. You skip one. You skip the best Silent Hill games, Origins. You can punch the monsters. <laughs> yeah, they are, they are good. Silent Hill 3 is nice. Which is scary. No, it's, 4 is dog shit. Silent Hill 3 has really good moments, like the mirror and the theme park and a few it's things here and there. Then again, maybe I'm blinded because I was a child. But I, as I said, Silent Hill 4 was really, really scary for me. It was one of those games that I really look away from the screen as a kid. Stars. Check this epic fight. I watched this fight from the best. Check it, from the best. Nice shot. I, I, yeah, I'm, I'm not doing. I'm not doing good. I want it from the best. There you go. Silent Hill is more intense. Silent Hill 3 has really nasty moments. Like. Dude, when you're in the subway, there's so many weird noises and moments in there. And there are so many weird cats, like the random guy that pulls you. The mirror. That's the overall insanity that the game gets. But Silent Hill 4 has a rabbit pointing at you. That's the scariest thing Jill. I've seen in my life. Jill! Hang in there! What have I done? I'm sorry, Jill. Please, wake up! Jill! Jill! 
October 1st, night. I woke up to the sound of falling rain. I can't believe I'm still alive. I'm still alive. Uh. Carlos? It looks like our roles have been reversed from when we originally met, huh? Don't worry, Jill. This chapel is safe. I've been infected by the virus, haven't I? Hey! Take it easy. I'm okay. Don't feel any pain. But that's what bothers me. If I can't feel anything, then what does that mean? Don't give up, Jill. I'll take care of you. Whatever you do, don't let that virus beat you. If I turn into a zombie, don't hesitate. I want your word that you'll kill me. Yes, I like to kill. Okay, whatever. Let's go. Yeah, I said also to try heal. Uh, whatever. Silent Hill 3 is the scariest Silent Hill game until you throw the steel pipe into the, the sewers. And you get the the golden and silver steel iron pipe. Sorry, the golden and silver pipe. Silent Hill 3 is the scarier until you play as Magic Girl Heather. <laughs> Silent Hill 3 is the scarier until you get the UFO in. <laughs> That is pretty scary. As I said, Silent Hill 3 also scared me as a kid. Not in the same way as Silent Hill 4, but... As I said many times, it's just... There's so much nerve in our aim for, especially when you reach the hospital and nothing is safe. It's just unnerving. Like, ooh, spoopy. Not as spoopy as Phasmophobia. Oh, shit. They got some good easter eggs. I like the easter egg. You know what I like? A brand new enemy. Yo, Carlos is Dark Souls emoting. Damn. I love this song so much. The room. I love it. It's been run by the Golden Pipe Speedrun. That's something I can enjoy. It's something like the dog ending. It's something that you really don't expect in Silent Hill. And out of nowhere, boom! A silly just dropped. I think Silent Hill 3 is the only one with that kind of easter eggs because Silent Hill 2 you have the the dog ending and that's it there's nothing else dude I love this song so much it's the the ambience of this music the room you see that <laughs> like one has I mean, one has the UFO ending that you need to... You need to be seen UFO to the entire game. Silent Hill 2 only has the dog ending. Even Silent Hill 3 has an easter egg referencing Silent Hill 2. But I think in Silent Hill 2 you can put your hand in up through the toilet or something. And I think if you do that with headers, it's like, who will do something like that? 
They got reference to to James. Also, there's a walnut key item. That's all you need. A walnut key item? Oh my god. Do I cannot see? So I was taking something real quick. No. Carlos. One of four. Okay. That would shit. I was thinking for a while. I, mean, I don't know if I still think about it. Get every <laughs> every single chiller sad game and play it on Sunday. Like some random Sunday streams. One or two games of his. Because I like him. He's a cool guy. He's one of those guys that I don't mind, you know, buying his shit because I think he's a solo player. You know, a solo developer, and he's a cool guy. With cool games and cool ideas. Can I show? What's going on? What kind of clips can you get from Watch Dogs? I'm one of the supervisors. That's all you need to know. No, please. Wait. They made the, this gentleman an actual character in remake. Not even a comment by Carlos. Holy shit. No, that's disrespectful. Sick room key. Unknown creaturas are so informal in. What's up? That's it. Hello. What is up, Mang? Was it here on the other side? Ow. What is up, Mang? How is it going in this wonderful Monday of number three? Because it's 15th. You know what that means? Three times five, it's 15. <gasps> remake compared to one and two, two and four. Because three remake is pretty much a DLC for remake two. That's it. <laughs> That's the only reason I can think about. It was supposed to be a DLC for Remake 2 and they were like... Fuck it. More money. Nah, but there's more to it. Basically, there's more to it. COVID or no COVID, it really so. Like, they spent years and years doing Remake 2. One of four, I'm sorry, put the opposite. They, they spent years and years doing Remake 4. And out of nowhere, they released that. And then after many, many years, they just they released this 4 Remake, which is perfect. I think there's more to it than just get a game out shit it's a big same because this game is really really cool 
This game is really, really nice. What are those clips? Whatever they are. Really. That's another point. They they remake what is for many people one of the best games of all time. So it's they got a challenge and they deliver. They actually deliver. And they better deliver, as I'm telling you. That's like one of the best games ever. Except to Konami. Well, Konami is another kind of... Um, it's another kind of brand, okay? Okay, let's watch this thing. Yeah, he's fine. Don't worry. I don't even know who this guy's name. What the fuck is this? I don't, oh no, no, we're not gonna do some kind of posting. I don't know who this guy's name is, but he's fine. Look at him. Neck broken. Neck broken. Neck broken. He's fine. He's Aiden. Well, Aiden broken. Aiden just got his neck broken three times. And he don't care, look. <laughs> He's fine. He's fine. Look at this. Like this. Okay, that car. Okay, do you know this? This is already an Ubisoft game. Look at the car. <laughs> I look how I think because I think this guy works with the hands on this on his pockets, but just by the animation, it looks like hands of ways. Like what is this? Like what just happened? Insane. Insane. <laughs> this is how you know it's an Ubisoft game. Incredible. Incredible watchdogs. <laughs> Just popping off. Car disappearing. <laughs> So first character saying your name. Only time in my life I've seen my name in a video game is fucking Roblox. On the pirate game that Chun wanted to play. Are they good watchdogs? Are there dogs in watchdogs? I know they are in two. Oh my god! When the dog is watching, am I right, fellas? glitches I still say that a massive oh shit I will still say that a, an open world game that is massive if it has silly glitches like that it makes it better I'm serious I know for many people that like sinful, like, no, dude, my immersion. I can assure you, I wouldn't have the same fun with Oblivion if the game wasn't a disaster. I'm honest. Oblivion with all the awkwardness of the NPCs and the glitches and how it works, it wouldn't be the same. Too many glitches. Yeah, I mean, like, the small ones. I mean, we don't need game-breaking bugs, of course, but... 
Some silly things like that, just out of nowhere, a car, dis a car disappears. Oh, you know, just <laughs> breaking your neck. Whoa. Yeah, because Ubisoft likes to... Ubisoft likes to, to copy. They are copying the Nintendo Wii online right now. Wait, wait, do you like frogs? Look, look, look at those frogs on the right. Let's see if I remember. I think it was just 1, 3 and B. I don't remember clearly. Almost. Take it on any time. You know, comments like that make me wonder why Ubisoft is not broken already. Ubisoft is the first video game company to erase a game and take it away from for everyone. That's just like. <laughs> oh, the frog is pissed. Look at the frog. Oh, damn. Okay. I just don't know what the Ubisoft is at this point. Just make a new Rayman. A new Rayman. That's just, I'd say. <laughs> That's a lie because, listen, Kakao, I know you love sleeping as much dogs. Yeah, Le Legion is shit, exactly. <laughs> I know about that. People people are kind of debasive when it comes to Watch Dogs 1. And people overall like Watch Dogs 2. Then Legion came out and everybody hated that thing. Single player franchise anymore. Yeah, I know. Ubisoft is clearly like... Oh, she's not, like, not here. How can this company still be a thing? I'm honest. There's so many weird decisions. Just the, just the idea of... You don't truly really own the games. Just by that, fuck you. Hi. 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 You were keeping them alive. They have something else, right? Besides Rainbow Six. I mean, they have... The... Oh yeah, they have a school and bones. <laughs> You have a skull and bones. <laughs> Better to have something else. Quadruple A game, yeah, more like. I, I, I don't even have a joke. Listen, the game itself is a joke. It's come and bone, there you go. The game itself is a joke. I don't need to say anything. But you know, it, it's a save because Ubisoft back in the day was respected. Ubisoft did Rayman, and Rayman was huge. I, I mean, maybe not huge, but it was big enough. And they have many things. I mean, the Rainbow Six was, used to be like single-player adventure games, right? First-person FPS, the Rainbow Six. And they have more things. The, I don't know, Ubisoft became like... Everything that is wrong. Didn't Ubisoft made Anthem or that was EA? I think that was Ubisoft. It is a disgrace. Okay, okay that was EA. It's the same shit. It's the same shit. God, the game's been worse every installment, yeah. Also, they forgot about... I mean, they remember that Prince of Persia exists now. With that... Oh, shit! Which I also remember back in the day, people got mad because... Assassin's Creed killed Prince of Persia, technically. Also, didn't help that both of the game had the gimmick of... Parkour and melee combat looking nice. 
And Assassin's Creed was doing great and Prince of Persia was doing really poor. Other us, AC. Hey, dude. Hello, ask you. Hello. Banner with Unity, Victorian, Owen, and us. Other us, AC. Other us, AC. That could be anyone. I like Unity. <laughs> That's the only one I completed. Okay? I, yes. it, it was a glitchy mess. Dude, I have pictures and videos of playing Assassin's no Creed way. Unity. That I have one. That I don't know how... What? An, I we an asset was a no, white square. Waiting for you. It's like an asset didn't load and it was a square. He's playing with us. Carlos, I have videos of glitches. I need to... I can show you. I, I think I still have on this PC. No, I don't think so. I'm sorry, Jill, but I've got to go I mean, not all of them. Are, uh, some of them are on oh, the cell phone. Bad news. I'm some others are on the PC, alive. which I don't even know where they are. Nikolai, are you sure? Yes. I don't know how, but I do know that he is our enemy. Remember, don't trust him. Where do we have a Roblox video? Wait. Oh, this might get loud. I apologize. But why do we have this? If it's loud... Listen, this might get loud. I'm sorry. Three, two, one. When did I did that? <laughs> oh, is it? I think it was deadly. I apologize. How do you even control volume of software just put on your US OBS? Wait for a second. I'm, I really apologize. Look at the guys. Everyone is here. Was a streamer kill the audience? Uh, I think I know what it could be. If they are even here. Oh, I think they are gone. Volume, nice. Nice, survive. Okay, I don't know where I have it, but I have pictures on the cell phone. Well, after killing the audience, let's kill Nemesis, okay? Yeah, nice, dude. You see, you're watching the good ones. You're not watching the good ones, not the dog shit ones like me. I need to apologize. I need to look for something. I, even though I say this all the time. A way to just make... Um, you know, when you put something on OBS, it doesn't kill everyone. Wait, I don't have regular grenades? Oh, there they are. Uh, this should be more than enough to kill the Messiah. But yeah, cool shit. Thanks, boys, for um, letting me kill you. I appreciate it. Oh, oh God. This man can dodge. I should have saved the game because this enemies do a lot of damage. Black Flag, Unity, Syndicate, and the Exit Collection. That's a, that's a lot of games. Games. There you go. Stars. 
assault rifle? Wait, oh shit, I miss a nemesis? Who? Which one? Dude, I lost infinite ammo. Ah, uh, whatever, I will use this for a while. Memory. The Ezio games are supposed to be good. Ezio games are supposed to be good. Never played one. As I say all the time, I only played... Unity. And Unity is supposed to be us. And it's funny because this friend I got that he played Assassin's Creed and he enjoyed the Assassin's Creed game. Not all of them, but a few of them. He told me that Unity is cool because it actually has decent stealth. And there was something I like about Unity is that you can play as non-lethal. There's a, there's a... You can choose to not kill. In, in fights. It does nothing to the game, but it, I think it's cool. Not as cool as missing the infinite ammo. But hey. Yeah, what if we play Assassin's Creed 1? Which people say it's good, but at the same time it's us. What if we play the first Assassin's Creed? Prince of Persia, The Sons of Time. Was it like a remake or something and it got deleted because it was us? Or something like that? It's not missing ammo, it's like missing unlimited ammo. So I guess I missed a nemesis or... Because there's no more nemesis fight. I'm getting into the lab and once you get into the lab, that's it. Well, I think I can fight him again. I think I have one more fight if I do nothing. I need to check. Sadness to cover my body. I think we're fine like this. But yeah, boys, good shit. Do whatever you like and be happy. I don't know why I just come out of nowhere, but do it. If you can kill me after, after the Roblox kill. Yes, I will discard it. Yes. You wanna know something that not, not that many people know? Check it out. Damn! I didn't know until a few years ago. This thing is doing that much. This weapon is deadly. Also, I like how the zombie looks like it's dancing. So here's the thing, there's like one hour of game left. Am I supposed to do something after the game? Or I can leave early for once. <laughs> We opened the max pin on hardcore. <laughs> we do it again. We beat Resident Evil 2. We open fishing in Resident Evil. 
I enjoy fishing, yes. Never fish in my life. Only the game. But not with a fishing rod. I don't even know how it's called. It's with a cord. Looking for silly Ragdolls in Max Payne. Playing the first ever game with Ragdoll physics. I can be a weirdo and play Silent Hill 3. You know? So I can live even earlier next, like next day. Oh shit, nice. Boys, you got me. I don't even want to be here. I want to be outside playing Pikmin. No! That did nothing. Well, it did that. What was the combination? Ah, filo de puta, agora se entendo. It's gonna be honor when I became the ultimate. When I became the ultimate, it will be honor. No, I'm kidding. I'm gonna be the ultimate when I be Monster Hunter Genesis Ultimate 100%. 400 hours to do every single mission, events included. Who, who's with me? Who wants to play Generations Ultimate until Monster Hunter Wilds comes out? <laughs> I really need to check for the actual playtime, but I think it just... It's a lot to do everything. The game is massive. Shit. Hey. Yeah, I said outs to everyone. Saudos to every single magnificent magnificent human being. Shout outs to you guys. Haha. <laughs> You truly are the ultimate. Have you noticed how I say that as soon as the first nemesis dies, the game is easier? I don't lie. I don't lie. I never lie. I think I'm more than ready to even beat the final boss and everything. Well, the final boss is not actually just shoot you until it dies. There's more to it. Where's the magnet? Ah, the magnet, yes. Uh, let me save just in case. Just in case, let me have a... Um... These are good explosives. So... Where's the acid? I 
Let's go with this, why not? A part of me wants to beat the game with 10 saves, but that means do the entire lap without dying. Which I guess is doable. Ha ha, ten! That's the number. Iron pipe. Silent here. Yo boys, good news. YouTube just sent me a message. Do you know do you know what the message is? It's really cool. The message says, check it out. The video is blocked. You can all watch it on YouTube. You know what that means? I need to edit the video again. Hey, so guess what? You have nothing tomorrow. Even if you want to watch some GTA 3 again? For the whole month. Do you know I was actually thinking about that? I was actually thinking about playing Witcher 3. Even if it's just a one-off. But at the same time, it's just... Uh... Okay, let me check the copyright claims that the real blood of GTA 3 just got. All supervisors, mission terminated. Return immediately. Repeat. All supervisors return immediately. So... Over. Yeah, we have more Bleach music. Because mu Bleach music played more than once. Hey, so guess what? I need to <laughs> reload the video again because you can watch it. I'm quite impressed you've managed oh. to stay alive up until now. And you seem to be doing a pretty good job of looking out I mean, for who yourself. The fuck was... How about helping out? What ultimate city do you? I have no intention. I mean, I just reloaded the. Because I mean, I have ready to show the GTA 3 Part One, the, the reload of GTA 3 Part One. You but YouTube didn't tell me that a song plays more than once, so now I have reloaded the song. The, the stream and since the song plays again it's Bleach OST again I need to read the video exactly. and edit that out although the conditions encountered on this That's operation epic. were extreme it was an unexpected outcome that the team would be wiped out we were only required to collect live data from the subjects oh. another mutant another mutant I love that line Give me a second, check in the YouTube thing. So yeah, pretty much is that. I need to re-edit the video. Because ma because YouTube didn't tell me that that's some place again. Which is funny because I was kind of sure it played Again, but they didn't know when because you do only tell you about it once. And please understand, I wasn't in the mood to watch the entire stream again. So. Good shit. <laughs> I love, I love shit like this. Yeah, that's it. He said the bleach music. Awesome, dude. Piece of blood. He has some Japan bullshit. So th there's also a chance I read the video. I re-edit the video 
but that same song plays once again. And then I need to re-edit the video for a third time, and reload for a third time. What's going on? Because I want to reload that. But I also want to reload by city. I need to I, need, I want to have everything. Oh my god! It's an evil worm. Unlimited Reload. I mean, I will need to delete the, the thing. What's even the point of having, you know, the thing there? Yeah. All that silliness, and I cannot have a 16 hour stream up. I cannot have up the best stream I ever done, and the only one that is worth watching. The only one I actually put effort in. This worm is kicking my ass. This thing is doing a lot of damage. Nice shot. YouTube is dog shit, I moved to Twitch. Which is equally dog shit, by the way. Fuck that, I'm going to Facebook Gaming. We are really close to for the anniversary of Seven Day Survivor. <laughs> Will you watch me if I move to Twitch? I hope the answer is no. Only reason to watch me on Twitch. Get banned? Live while playing Funger. That's it. I'm gonna do IRL streams. I'm gonna do IRL streams. I'm gonna do reaction streams. I'm gonna do league streams. I'm gonna tackle every single topic that gets you views. I don't care about anything anymore. Shut up. I don't give a shit, dude. It just, it just, it just time. It, it's time rendering the video. I need like a lot of power just to render the video. So right now, as I'm telling you, most likely you, there's nothing tomorrow. I want to have this on YouTube just to, hey, he's GTA 3 part one again. I cannot do it. Yes, it will take a lot of time. And what I think is buffering is that YouTube has an editor. But the editor only works if the video is really short. Like, less than 4 hours. So right now, if this... I mean, right now it's fine, but... If you do more than that, you cannot edit the video. 
And I think you can fight this nemesis. And if I kill him, I can just get the unlimited ammo. But at this point, I don't even care that much. Fake gamer, I know. Or like piece of shit gamer. Stars. My eyes. I'm gonna push him off. It's shit, the Messiah. Damn. How's the ball? Ice is snarf. Whatever, dude. I can also be an asshole and not upload it. You weren't there when the stream happened? Fuck you. I mean, at the end of the day, it's just whatever. I, I don't even know how many people Let watch us. past bots, which I guess is... Jill, listen very nothing. Carefully. 0 0.1, maybe. They're planning on launching a missile directly into the city as soon as day breaks. The explosion will be powerful enough to destroy everything. Are you sure about that? Positive. I heard it straight from a supervisor. They'll go this far to cover their tracks. Come on, we have to hurry. There isn't much time left. There isn't much time left. Really? What if I just sit here and do nothing? Until the missile, ar missile arrives. Manager's diary, more like, no, I don't care. It's okay, dude. I'm happy being irrelevant until the day I die. That's how I hope. That's how I hope my life goes. Until the bitter end of reality. You have a luck, friend. <laughs> There's like a glitch here that you can just... You can just push that... I don't know how it is. Big steam puzzle. Bien. Never mind. Yeah, good shit. Who cares about bots? Some are right, fellas. You want that bot, you have like cooler people. Like, watch the news. Well, don't watch the news, they suck. <laughs> you open the news and it's just terrible. It's just depressing. Just isolate, isolate yourself from reality and play video games and develop nothing from your life be worthless and useless just like me nah, I'm kidding, don't do that fight for your dreams man fight for what you like fight for the funny ragdoll Fight for what you love. A kebab.
for, a, for an arepa. Fight for the arepa. Oh god. I haven't used the shotgun yet. Oh, dude, this shotgun is so cool. It's awesome. I haven't used that thing yet. Okay, I guess I'll use it now. No. This residence sued as evil. Okay, I'm, switch I'm switching to shotgun. Now, this is a puzzle that when I was a kid, it destroyed my brain. And it's nothing. That shotgun, this one. Um, cool. Cool game plan. Water sample. Yeah, this is a puzzle that really ruined me as a kid, but I really had no idea what to do. Until you realize the solution, and the solution is just match. I don't even need more ammo. I think I'm more than enough to beat the game. Do I still have the Magnum? Oh yeah. Check it. Here it comes, check it. Badass puzzle. Look at this badass puzzle. Badass music from for badass people. We are not done here.
think he made those clips on the last days of, of the game. But it's almost everything looks like the very the, the end of everything. Oh, this brain is not working. This puzzle always got me. This silly water puzzle. Red, red has to be this. Welcome to the where they, the game becomes slow. Because I need to think. Is it? Destroy it. Destroy it. Boys, we are eighty subscribers away to enable red super chats. So what are you doing? Hit subscribe and give me your money. I will buy things that you don't want to know. Give me your money, dude. That's all I need to say. Is there something more queer than give me your money with nothing in return? You get nothing. In fact, if you talk back, you're getting banned. How about that? No, that's a that's a, that's a good trade-off. Come on, come on, you gotta admit, you won't have a better deal. <laughs> I don't give a single shit about switch and everything. Only reason I would care is emotes, but still, you need to pay for that, so I, I care even less now. Ow! Who the fuck will pay for membership on this channel? Only to put an easy key face. No. You know what you're gonna do? You go to McDonald's and you get a burger. Or whatever you want. Or you get something to enjoy, like this. How about that? How oh, fuck you, is that I mean? We're fine. Check it. The carpet. The carpet. Oh, sorry, give me a second. It is. Here I go, rougher than the rest of them, the joint of them. Oh, yeah. Check it, dude. We're gonna do a thing. We're about to do a thing that no one has ever done before. 
card key reader. You see? Waste time. No one has ever done this. No one has ever done that. You're welcome. For the first time you've seen that. I'm going to say because we fight uh, an interesting fight, let's say. Yeah, you're welcome. You just watch for the first time in your life. Insanity. Okay, boys, I'm ready to escape the nightmare and go home and eat arepas while playing some sweet Pikmin. Who's with me? No one, because no one's invited. If you want to join, let's say that uh, I, I want to see the color red. How about that? How about that? I want to see the color red. Nikolai? So, you want to get out of here alone? Is that your plan? I made certain none of the other supervisors survived. Since I'll be the only one who knows what really Oh, shit, I think the video have more bargaining power when it goes copyright claim again bonus. with another song that cannot I cannot so. kill me. I'm not on their payroll. They Oh, never mind, the, in the end, banding Belarusia and Russia, so it's somewhat irrelevant. The confirmation of your death. That's great, except I have no intention of contributing to your retirement fund. He's fine. He's fine. He just overreacting. Oh shit! Making sure. There you go. You print money. I like money. That's a real line from Nikolai in Remake. You print money, and I like money. Warning. Proceeding with operation in treatment. Please evacuate immediately. Oh no. An evil fight is coming our way. Dude, he just entered like the Undertaker. Now this is a fight. Wow. That was deadly. Ow. Cheat. I'm dead. Oh good place. I think that's the only way he can kill you. But this never is do a lot of damage. And again, it's hard. Mode. Yeah, imagine never is just just say arepa.
Look, he got key, don't lie. Arepa. I really want to eat an arepa. Joint, 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 I like money. And you bring money. Oh shit, what is happening? This is the stream every time YouTube does a copyright claim. That nukes it from YouTube. This is the video. Just to the garbage to melt. Thank you. Are you passing me the goblin? What if I what if I make peace with the orangutan and the goblin by selling an, an arepa? This is my steel. I think we'll, there's another boss fight coming up. Yeah, you can choose not to fight the helicopter. At least it's the Magnum. The Magnum Real? Where is it? I don't even remember how the helicopter boss fight works. I think you just shoot it and it blows up. Have you ever shot a helicopter with a magnum? You know something I remember in the Modern Warfare 2 day that got me really happy? Destroying a Harrier with a gun, with a, a handgun, the most basic one. I remember doing that and I felt happy. And it was a massive waste of time. But I was happy. Jill! Jill, where are you? If you can hear this transmission, respond immediately! I'm here. What's up? I got us a ride. The chopper engines are running and ready to go. On my way. On my way. About to become ground zero. Hurry up. 
And don't forget to take that device with you. What that does device. it do? That device tracks the distance of the approaching missile. Make sure you bring it with you. Now listen to me. Don't give up. We're both gonna survive this. Just get over here. <laughs> it's a portal radar receiver. Okay. That is epic. Warning. Missile attack confirmed. No. Warning. Missile attack confirmed. Emergency level D. All personnel evacuate. How can they do something like that? Oh wait, there's no Nikolai Bosel because Nikolai is dead, so I just... I'm an idiot. Hey, guess what? There's no actual boss fight if the boss dies before the boss fight. How's that? Nice shot. Oh, he's dead. Did you know bosses cannot fight back if they die before the actual boss fight? That's a mechanic in Metal Gear 3, remember that? Remember when the end died of old age? Wow. Now that's... That's how you fight a boss. And this is the final boss. Umbrella's deadly by weapons. Yeah, he's sitting down. The man is chilling. Checking system. Checking data. Cool boys. Warning. There is not enough power to activate the system. Now that's a cool voice, if I ever listen to one. Can I just escape? Can man just escape? There you go. Oh my god. It's him! And he's having nourishment. He's getting me banned on YouTube. It's him. Yeah, look at him. It's him. He's a brand new Pokemon. out I'm about to shoot my super omega cannon ow Welcome to Power War 2, featuring him. Oh wow. Okay, stay there, friend.
He is climbing. He has pushed me to the rail, to the thing. Wow. Cool. No estoy there, okay? I think we're done. Never mind. I think he's deadly. Okay, I think now we're done. Okay, that was epic. Warning. System overheating. Engine will happen. Enter. Wow, well, there's no... There's no cross region. You get a man from every continent. There's no cross region gameplay tournament. That's disappointing. Exterminate the monster. Of the continent. Continent. That really limits your two players on the joint server. I like how League of Legends poisoned you so much that you want to go back to Overwatch. Oh well. Jill, Jill we did it! Over here. Cool, yeah. You can see it. What if you hide bots? Oh by the way we won. Game is over. We're done. What if you cheat and you get like big people? Right, then we're out of here. Oh no. Oh no. It's here. It's here. It's him. It's time to go. Yo, that's gonna be the YouTube channel when I go to know. Wait. <laughs> that's gonna happen. <laughs> okay, I'm not, I'm not, I don't live in America. Dude, you watch me, you watch me play Max Payne. Do you really want me in your team? I play Mercy or you lose. And either way, I will, I will just miss the beam. President and the Federal Council have passed judgment over the civilians of Raccoon City. The President and I will the move Council to to USA just to play Overwatch on the joint team. Is the best course of action. Worst player in the entire video game moves to another continent just to play a tournament and lose. Raccoon City has been literally That's me. Current reports have the death toll surpassing the one. Dude, I'm moving to Venezuela. I want real arepas. Our hearts go out to those poor civilians. Real arepas. Well, I mean, I just... The funny. 
funny. It'll be funny. I'm gonna kick their asses with my four hours of free to play McCree on Overwatch 1. Yeah, I'm gonna destroy them. And my 30 minutes of Ana. I can play any role. And that's it, we're done. Epic. This game is epic, dude. This game is awesome. And that's how you kill Nemesis. And you perform the last escape. That's it, we're done. Now enjoy the music. And think about your memories. And how I played this game more than 20 years ago. And how nothing has changed. I'm still useless. With nothing in my life. Achieve nothing. This game is great. Team <laughs> Boromir. Dude, Team Boromir, if we lose, we get banned. Oh, by the way, I mean, uh, I'm gonna say that again just for fun. I reloaded the GTF3 part 1. It's still banned. They got banned. There was the guy getting blow up, the Ukrainian fella, just getting blow up, like, oh, yeah. That's one of the best videos ever, the guy blowing up in Alien Isolation, whatever the game is. Not as good as this song. It's funny because when you are a kid and play a game like this, it feels like it takes forever to beat it. Now it's, it's been four hours. Like, what is the plate I'm going to be? Four, four, five? It's impressive. Fun, yeah. Dying is illegal on Twitch. So pretty sure that's why he got banned. Did you know if you die live on Twitch, you get banned? Four, five. Three, thirty-one. Oh shit, great E. Great E because uh, if you turn the E upside down, it looks like a three. And this is the we're playing games with number three. Warframe survival mission for 30 minutes. That sounds super fun. That sounds incredibly fun right now. I don't even know what a survival mission is in Overwatch in, over, in Warframe, but yeah, pretty sure you're having fun in there. Pretty sure. Okay, now what? Oh, see, you know what we do now? I'll tell you what we do now. Oh! The extra game. Operation Machaco. Three hours. Dude, the most I've been a survival, I think it's almost one hour in Left 4 Dead 2. And because me and my friend found like, at the spot that you are invincible, that no one can touch you. It was just me waiting, and that's it, talking about life. After escaping the city, Jill set out to join Chris Redfield. However, all she found was an empty hideout of Chris's. On the floor was Chris's knife. Jill left without hesitation because she firmly believes that Chris is still alive. She will search for him until she finds him. Then they can go and put an end to Umbrella. <gasps> oh, in the next Resident Evil adventure, Leon S. Kennedy moves to Spain to save the daughter of the President of the United States. I am a sleepy yo and I trust Leon with my life to save my daughter. Yes, Mr. President, I will suplex this old lady that has been possessed by some kind of plague. And that is one of the best games ever, Resident Evil 4. Awesome. A new ranking system. Oh, shit. What is the ranking from dog shit into um, get a life? 
Arnold Arnold de rankings Do Lowest Dog shit Highest Get out The mercenaries Oh shit Damn Call for my English shattered That's because they know you betray them by playing League of Legends. They know the betrayal. Let's pick Carlos. I think you can play as Jill in some versions. Maybe Dreamcast. I think Dreamcast is a better version of this. You have like more outfits. And more of everything. Welcome. The rules are simple. In order to dispose of the bomb implanted in your body, you must reach the target point. Keep in mind that there will be various obstacles in your way, so do not be afraid to use whatever means necessary to reach your goal. Good luck. Good luck. <laughs> okay, who's ready for an epic adventure of Carlos Oliveira? He's gonna fight for Brazil. You have master and more. They fucking have already. I don't worry, dude. I mean, you're a good gamer. You can do it. You surely can do it. Someone like you. You pick your main guy, which uh, uh, whoever that is. Shit. What are my headshots? You pay your main fella, the, the the new guy, whoever his name is. Shit, don't get anything out of that much. And then you kick us. What the unit? Do it for a dead Discord server. <laughs> do it for a dead Discord server. That all we do is post a meme from time to time and then bully because of whatever. Oh shit. You know what I say about that, right? Dude, explosive barrel, Carlos. Oh, I died. <laughs> it happened again. It happened again. So works. Oh, the real team. That's on the story then. Just, just, just get your boys. I don't even know how many of your boys play League of Legends, not League of Legends, Overwatch. You get in there and you do goats. Even though I think the game forces you to be like what? One tank, two DPS, and two supports, right? Zero. They are free. Hack the game so you can play everyone with one key keyboard and one mouse. Three soldiers have lost have lost their edge. Welcome. The rules are simple. The rules are simple. You beat Devil May Cry 2 and I will remove the bomb implanted in your body. No, that's a challenge that Sok will do. Ow! Okay, 
Do you mean they goats? Wait, you guys still do goats? Isn't that supposed to be illegal? Completely illegal. Oh, you mean playing with multiple characters with your own one keyboard? Play with one only, only one keyboard. And you hack the game and you are one Macri and one Macri and all mercies. Isn't that a strategy? I don't even know, do I don't play League? Free Overwatch. I don't play League either, I'm free. the dream dude what if you only play custom games that pretend to be overwatch 1 maybe you can have more fun in there there was there were some spots in this mercenaries mode that you can get extra time and get accumulative <laughs> I don't even know, there has to be something. What if you enter a roleplay server? Carlos! Carlos! You're the stuck. Just play one of these roleplay servers. I'm looking for a pocket. I'm looking for a pocket mercy. In competition. You mean who paid more money to get the latest skin <laughs> yeah not surprised Oh shit. Ow. I like when League of Legends players said, I like your skin, thanks. And minutes later they're talking shit to each other. Why you do this? Shut up. I'm playing the... Okay. I'm playing the mercenaries. Operation Mike Jackal. Oh god! You leave me alone. Push! Oh god. What a waste of life. of the trip. Ah, uh, a clothing challenge. It was interesting. Okay, I'm wearing this. Who am I?
So I'm gonna guess in every single skin, skin competition in, in Overwatch, if the skin is horny, you win. Is that it? Most of the time. Interesting concept for um for a challenge. I might die, but I think I'm low on time. Ow. Insane mini games from Overwatch franchise. Oh shit, what are you doing here, buddy? You were too late. <laughs> it's shit, don't care. <laughs> you were too late. Well, I'm about to blow up, so maybe I will just die too. Yeah, I think I'm going to die. I'm going to explode. Out. Thank you. Can you move? Thank you. Don't care. Nice! Yellow Caution, the cap attack. Classic. People are just having fun. Leave them alone. I don't even know. At this point, I don't even know who plays Overwatch. I guess everyone, because the last time we checked, there were like 6 million players. That could also be lies. Okay, let me beat this now, but I'm just gonna run for my life. I'm helping no one. <laughs> just go road holding every time. Uh, I remember. What if I just tank everything and rescue people? Take it out. This is how a true warrior does the fight. There are so many cool challenges in this, like... Nikolai knife everything. Best rank. Because Nikolai has like a, the basic handgun and a knife. Everything else is like healing. Once. Wait, so the joke of I'm looking for a pocket mercy or some shit like that is real? Yeah. That was interesting. It never was a joke.
I guess people just want to know each other, and that's it. I mean, I respect that, but... It sounds weird. Hello. I'm Gold 3. And I'm Main Para. Tinder Watch. I mean, it's just... For statistics alone, that got to work. To someone at least. So one found a special song when in Tinder Watch by Statistics alone. Never too old to dream. What if I do an Overwatch 2 stream and I just find in these weird game modes? No, fuck Overwatch. Never forget, if I do an Overwatch stream, I'm obligated to do a League stream. Like back to back. You're getting nothing. Looking for a busy long one. There you go. What is cooler? Trying to find your special song one in Overwatch or in Roblox? Chill and kill. <laughs> Chill and kill. <laughs> Real conversación. <ríe> Real conversación. I don't even know what to spit anymore, dude. What even are the limits of how create your own game mode? Is, are there even any? It's like Roblox, you do whatever you want. Dude, what if we play... No. Oh, shit. What if we play Overwatch on Roblox? How about that? Left for the in Overwatch more. Wasn't there like a wave mode, like a north mode for Halloween? I remember they put that for Halloween almost every year. It got a point that people hated that. People hated that game mode because it was the same thing every year. Help! Help! Oh god. Uh, 
you got Brad. One for one, yeah, they suck us. I think there was also for one time a, a arena mode. Well, a 1v1 or a 2v2 arena mode. But the objective is to kill people. Are you sure about that? Oh, don't, don't decapitate. Thank you. It was an entity. Shit, my bad. I get him beat for nothing. Dude, just yeah, yeah, tell her that you were chilling. That's it. Isn't that what cool guys say? Oh, you know, baby, I was chilling. <laughs> I went to gold because I wanted to play with my homies. Don't make up the date. Oh! The door, Carlos. Chilling and killing. If I keep getting beat, I'm gonna just die. I'm gonna blow up. I want to go home and play DMC2, dude. That's all I want. I just have a bomb in my body. This is where the fun starts. Oh god, look at him. Thank you. Shit. No! Help! Look at this tunnel! I'm going to die, man. It cannot end like this. I mean, I'm not that far away, but... I think I'm dead. <laughs> you don't want a pocket mercy? You should add people on this and have some weird voices. Like, oh yeah, dude, it's me. I'm the guy you play with. Me. Let's be a problem. That's the funny thing, right? Shit. Hey, sleepy boy. <laughs> yeah, it's me, I'm the guy. We're in the moon, Emmy. I think I'm not winning. Get out of my way. I'll have to do something risky. Uh, 
Yo! Carlos, you have a zombie next to you. Can you see that the zombie next to you? I think I'm dead. 20 seconds, that's nothing. I'm dead. It's gonna be happening. Oh god. I need to fill their dark souls with light. It's gonna end like this. No. I'm dead. I'm gonna blow up. Can you change your voice to a doctor? I just blow up. Well, rest in peace, I guess. Rest in peace. Okay, cool game. What are we doing now? Nothing or what? Yeah, I guess we're doing nothing. How do you even do a voice change? I want to do some weird shit with my microphone. I want to give my microphone an even worse quality. Yeah, this guy is a fake gamer. He cannot defeat the mercenaries. Operation Majakal. He truly is the biggest scam. There you go. <laughs> Do a stream on that scene. I stream the game. Oh, what is this? What? Who is that? Fuck Overwatch, dude. We play a cool competitive game. We play. I don't even know. I have nothing else to say. I have nothing silly to say. There's nothing to say. But yeah, good shit. Cool Resident Evil. Wasn't that fun? I mean, disappointed in beat the. The cool as fuck uh mercenary, yes, but oh well. That's how it is. That's how it is. Sometimes you be the resident evil and sometimes you just blow up in a minigame. You know? It's like Mario Party. And now I just I guess I live. Or what? Yeah, let's let me fuck off. There's nothing else to say, or nothing else to do. Or I may mean, I have something to do, like try to fix the GTA 3 part 1, so I can, we can actually have that on YouTube. So no one can watch it. Hey, is that a stream? That's it, nothing else. Yeah, thanks for watching, okay? That was really cool and really nice. I love this game. It's really fun and great. So I'm just gonna go away. Okay. You take care now. You enjoy your thing. And 
I'm not here tomorrow, so I guess whatever. If I don't get if I don't get hit by lightning, it will be Silent Hill three on Wednesday. So yeah, I guess. So yeah, thanks for watching. Thanks for uh, the sillies. Thanks for the willies. Thanks for fighting the evil resident. You know that's the funny line, right? That's the funny line. So do take care now, okay? Enjoy your Overwatch game. Enjoy your whatever you're doing. Enjoy your day. Just enjoy. For me, it's time to vanquish myself into the night and come back. Um, I guess Wednesday for Silent Hill 3. See, I don't know. Yeah, thanks for watching. Thanks for everything. Take care. Have a good one. And enjoy whatever you're enjoying right now. And take care, okay? What are your clock sense? Goodbye. Take care. That's it. No, no more fooling.